I'm just gonna start up because I was trying to type to you guys and Charlie's just stepping on the keyboard. <laughs> That's why you see that and nothing after it. That was supposed to be a sentence and Charlie's like, hi guys. Hello, happy Thursday. My bot is, is dead. Hi Panda, hi Toodles. Hi Slacksman, hi Queero, hi guys. I hope you're having a good week. Let me fix the bot. I don't know why it's being so stupid lately. It's so weird. It's every time I like... I gotta... I gotta kill it. It won't quit out. And a son and you love Charlie. Yes. That sums up completely. <laughs> hey Lagmo, how you doing? I'm just gonna fix my bot. Gonna restart it hopefully. That seems to fix it every time. I'm not sure why. It's just that first time it starts up, it's like, nah, I don't I don't feel like showing you quotes today. Very weird. And then we do some brushing. Your boss told you to start going back to the office again today. You're going back to studying to move on from the role again. Good for you, Socks, man. Good for you. Have you been remote this whole time? The thing, like, the, the bullshit is, like, these companies gotta realize that they're gonna lose good people if they force them to come into the office. Like, you, I'm sure you've been doing your job how many years remote now? Like, there's no reason for you to go in. You can get your work done, clearly, from uh, from home, remotely. It's so annoying, because it, it saves you time, it saves you money on gas, it saves you mileage on your car, like, it saves you from catching whatever bullshit your coworkers decided to bring into work. I got sick so many times at the bakery because people just came in sick because they didn't have sick time. So they would just like share whatever flu bullshit they picked up. Like there's there's some jobs where there's no need for that. You are so good. Oh my goodness. You're so pretty. Look at this pretty bitch. Uh, but yeah, hopefully Soxman, you can find something remote that is a better fit for you. Because that's some bullshit and I feel for you. I'm looking for something too now, but uh, not sure what. <laughs> Three years, yeah. So obviously you can do, you can work remotely. Obviously you've shown that you can do it for three freaking years. And that's something that's really gets put on a resume if you're looking for a similar job. What's up, Captain Hazard? Have you seen the Hyperlight Breaker trailer? I saw... I think little snippets of it. Is there a full trailer? We can watch that. Um, is it mu it's multiplayer, right? I loved Hyper Light Drifter. That would be super cool if it turns out good. The music was so good. We're supposed to do three times a week. But you don't have enough work most days. Sit around for eight hours a day. They didn't keep track of who went in or not. So you kind of ignored it, but they're supposedly trying it. Good lord. That's the other thing too, like, you're getting- are you- are you salaried, Soxman? Like, you're getting paid to, like you said, do fuck all. So why not do that at all? It's like... I, I don't understand. It's so ridiculous. That's- all that shit is just so some middle manager gets to justify keeping their job. Like, that's the- that's the only way. That- that's the only reason I could see for that bullshit. Like, I've been working from home too. If I, if this company, like, were a nearby company and not remote to start with, and they were like, hey, come in and do the same shit you did from home, but here, I would leave. <laughs> it's, 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 some people too, like, they work better on their own at home when they're comfy and not with other coworkers distracting them, and just letting them do their work. The best compromise would be to let people go into the office if they want to. And then if you don't want to, you don't have to. Or like, have you come in if there's really important meetings. But there's no reason to force people. Like, the traffic, guys, is so fucking bad. 
I don't know how people commute anymore. Like, if I were to, I haven't had to commute in the past couple of years. If I were to try to commute again, I would just, I would like, be so angry all the time. It's bullshit. There's a gameplay trailer. Oh, it's this spring? Early access already? Like, just spring TBD, they don't have a month yet, or? Early access, huh. That might be fun to try. I think that was multiplayer, right? I never played it. They did another game. They did a Solar Ash Kingdom. Did anyone play that? It looked kind of cool, but it was kind of expensive. I think it was like 40 bucks, so it was, uh, excuse me, a bit too pricey for me to try out for an indie. Your manager's not a middle manager. He has stuff to do. Yeah, okay, so that's weird then. Freaking middle management. You gotta be careful. Insulting min middle managers. You don't know who. You don't know who in Twitch chats a middle manager out there. Someone out there might be a middle manager. They might get offended. The middle managers out there. Uh, you definitely have days where you would do better in the office, and it, yeah, you've used it exactly. The flexibility. The flexibility is, is uh, I think, the best compromise for people. We need to revolt. Like, we just need a general strike and we need to eat the rich. <laughs> we're, we're overdue. Like, in France, they fucking, like, France knows what's up with their protests. Here, we're just fucking lazy. Are we treating? We treating? Yes. I think we need to break out the guillotines, guys. <laughs> I think we're overdue. We gotta, we gotta threaten the rich. Threaten the oligarchy. All right. Let us work from home. There you go. <laughs> it might not taste like your HelloFresh socks, man. <laughs> she just went like. <laughs> she just, thank you for treating her toodles. She just like vacuumed that up. <laughs> Kirby mode. You have been so spoiled today. You're so good. You are so good. She took a massive poop before the stream, so she's feeling great. Just, just all emptied out. <laughs> She's doing great. K word. L. Ellen? Not Ellen DeGeneres. <laughs> I know who you mean. I know who you mean. You can use spices. It'll be good. You watch Hannibal once. Or many times. The show or the movie? Because the show is great. Hannibal, Hannibal show, fantastic. Your favorite 1% buzzword is quiet quitting. Like, no, we just stopped caring right after the world almost fell apart. Like, I was reading an article about this earlier. It wasn't, it was an article or a tweet. I can't remember who cares. Like, the fucking quality of writing's about the same. Um, but they were talking about, um, Again, just not having enough applicants for jobs or, again, like, the quiet quitting phenomenon. And it, they're saying basically the same thing, like, when uh, essential workers realized that society basically treats you as disposable, they're like, fuck that noise, and they just quit. Like, there's nothing, nothing quiet about it. It's just like, fuck this. <laughs> it seems like a pretty uh, loud fuck you to that. That whole being undervalued and underpaid, it's just bullshit. Everything's bullshit. I feel like I gotta go listen to fucking Limp Biscuit, like break stuff, <laughs> like in the rain show. <laughs> Mood, fabulous. Poop, massive. Charlie, beautiful. Look at his little face. Oh, I got his little face. What's up, Risu? You've been working on regex for the last three hours, and your brain is mushy. Well, welcome. To, this is a, is a good a good place for, for mushy brain hangouts as a fellow mushy brainer. Hope you had a good day, Risu, outside of the, the mush brain. It's almost like people have power and that's why they keep trying to get us to hate each other. Like, all of the stuff that's popping up, like, with the different, uh... Like different movements to that are transphobic or racist or whatever, the main drivers of those movements I don't think are average Joes. I think it's the oligarchy trying to keep the average Joes from punching up. They want us to punch each other instead of punching up. 
So they're very, uh, very keen on those different, uh, schisms, I guess, between people being a thing. Religious beliefs, too, with all the abortion stuff, abortion, anti-abortion stuff popping up. Get out of the way, you fucking pair. Oh, it was Pikuniko. I'm like, what, <laughs> what game would that be? There was a pair. There was a pair. It was really productive. That's good to hear, Risu. Good to hear. You had a nice productive day. I got moved to my new book today, but didn't start up the reviewing. But the new book has six editors, and the most I've had is four, so it should be exciting. Also, it's the, I think I told you guys, the basic bitch book, Young Master's Unexpected Cute Wife. Um, we'll see how it goes. Oh, we got a new email. New email just dropped. What is this? Oh, of course. That's a good, this is a classic. I've had it. There you go. Bye, babe. Bye, bunny. Why doesn't the bigger class simply eat the smaller class? That's a very good question, Aquir. Soxman has his fork and, and uh, knife already. <laughs> I feel like they wouldn't taste very good. Oh, another what one. What the hell? What's up, Luke? What's up, Zillwood? How you guys doing? <laughs> so cute. Oh my god, this is what I do to Charlie all the time. Perfect. That's perfect. So cute. So darn cute, she likes it. She likes it. Zelwood, have you seen Exo Primal? I'm curious if that's a game that would be up your alley. It is PvP VE, which I remember being a thing you liked. <laughs> and it's got dinosaurs. It might be trash. It kind of looks like Anthem, which makes me uh, very concerned about the quality. But you get to shoot dinosaurs. It's like Dino Frame. You're doing good, Luke. I'm doing all right. You get the fava beans and a nice. He does it like. He says, <laughs> the lion's like teeth. <laughs> Hannibal's so creepy. So creepy. You watched a demo. It's in an arena. Is it? I don't watch too much about it. I might try it out. I was thinking about it, but we'll see how Bloodborne goes tonight. Okay, she wants you down. Good girl. Oh, girl. You ate all your food, Bubba. You ate it all already. Hi, Grim. Grim sending you love, Charlie. She's uh, confused because I put her on the floor and there's no food, so now she doesn't know what to do with her life. Is Dino Crisis but desperate? <laughs> um. How is it Dino Crisis other than it has dinosaurs in it? It doesn't seem anything like Dino Crisis. It has dinosaurs. It, it honestly, like I said, it reminds me more of Anthem than anything. So it might be pretty bad, but it also looks like the type of thing you just play when you're drunk with friends <laughs> and it's on Game Pass and everyone that has Game Pass can just play it. In an arc. Arc campaign. I don't know anyone who plays Arc, aside from you. Never really got into it. It has dinos. It is Dino Crisis. Arc. <laughs> they modeled one of the characters. Yeah, I mean they they do stuff like that in their games though. They have like little Easter eggs and references to other games, but I don't think the gameplay looks much like what I've seen of Dino Crisis. Cause Di Dino Crisis is survival horror. I thought this is like. Survival stupid. It's just like big action. Like it, the closest game. It looks. It looks like a baby. Like EDF and Anthem had a baby. From what I've seen of it, it's definitely the like you can tell. Unfortunately, looking at certain games, like you can tell, looking at it, it's not going to last very long, <laughs> even with the crossplay. So my thought with this game is Capcom is probably kind of beta testing crossplay. Are there other Capcom games with crossplay? Because they did a survey for Monster Hunter. They did a survey for Monster Hunter um, to see if people want to crossplay. And everyone was like, fuck, of course we want crossplay. And they said, oh, we can't do it with Rise. It's too late, but maybe the next title. So my thought is they might be seeing 
with their engine uh, and everything. I don't understand what it takes to implement crossplay, but I think this is a beta test also for crossplay in their games for Monster Hunter. In the future, that could be copium. But we'll see. Ugh. All right, should we get into Bloodborne? Should we get into Bloodborne? Bloodborne. You made the beta download. Okay. Two only twenty minutes. In. Yeah, again, I don't know if we're, I don't know if I'm playing it tonight. It just depends on how we're doing with with um Bloodborne. What bosses did you fight last stream? I fought Vicar Melia and the Witch of Witches of Hemwick, which is like basically not even a boss. They're they're a joke. They're a set piece. It's like hide and go seek boss. Um Vicar Amelia went down so fast, I'm still in shock about Vicar Amelia being so easy. Like, why was it so easy? She just she just staggered and died. The thing that shocked me was because I usually when I play, I go to um Old Yarnum first, and take out Bloodstar Beast first, and then do Amelia, so I end up like a billion levels. Yeah, I had a plus six. I think that was the biggest thing. It was the plus six. I don't really know how to play, though. Like, I looked at the VOD to see what happened, because I was just so confused. I got hit a lot. She just doesn't have a lot of one-shots. Like, I got hit quite a bit, and fucked up dodging, and still managed to do it. I think the main thing is just the limb breaking. That I don't normally do. I normally just hit her butt <laughs> like, pray she dies fast. <laughs> Not stuck on Gascoigne, no. He was harder than her. Gascoigne took me double digit tries and Amelia took three or four. I think it was the second try after I upgraded the weapon she died. You've been struggling with Amelia on your new game plus. The new game plus scaling in Bloodborne though is kind of rough, isn't it? I didn't- I, I never really did like a lot of the New Game Plus cycles. Yeah, I, I noticed with the limb breaking, I never- again, like when I- when I play Bloodborne, when I played Bloodborne, this is the first time in four years, so- but when I- back when I obsessively played in like 2017, 2018, um, I didn't really have much of a strategy for anything. It's just a lot of R1, L1 mashing. <laughs> <laughs> and there's VODs that show that. Um, and it it kind of works with Bloodborne, because you can be more aggressive and you do have the rally mechanic, but as far as like actual strategy, there wasn't really much of like, focus on this limb and then the other limb. All that stuff. Uh, what's up, Zodak? How you doing? Back to packing. Good luck with the packing, toodles. You, it's this weekend, right? The uh, one that you're just attending? Instead of, uh, tabling. Alright. I think we can start up. I, wanna, I just I just want to play Bloodborne. Excuse me. Also, I got a capture card for the camera. So, we're going to test it out. We're test it out. Oh, you're- Oh, sorry, I'm confused. You're tabling but not flying. So, wait, so, was there one you're going to that you're not... Tabling? I think I might have just misunderstood what you said last time. Well, that's good, though. Oh, you're flying in a couple of weeks. Okay. Well. You don't attend concert fun anymore. So what the heck did you... I don't know what you said that I misinterpreted entirely. But I don't blame you for not attending them for fun after having to work them. But good luck with the packing. And I'm glad you don't have to fly. Because flying is a pain in the... But, all right, um, I'm gonna just deactivate this. Still gotta find a way to switch scenes without having to do all this camera shenanigans, but should be able to use this camera now and also the PlayStation. Also, the capture card is called an easy cap and it just makes me think easy clap, which is very <laughs> Very appropriate for Twitch. Um, okay. Turn this thing on. 
Again, I don't know. That, I really don't think this is going to be a full BBL4 run. You don't know if you're Splatfesting, but do you want a particular team? Um, I thought we were doing Nessie. It seemed like the cons consensus, and I figured you would probably want Nessie because he's like a lizard thing. <laughs> Am I correct? <laughs> was, that, was I correct in my guess? Oh, you'd pick aliens. Okay, yeah, I was torn between aliens or lizard. The lizard thing. I wasn't sure. No one likes Bigfoot. Bigfoot's just a smelly, hairy thing. What's up, Moosey? How you doing? Um, alright. How is this thing? Since you're not really able to play, you wouldn't push for it. Yeah, I, don't, I think Greeny said they wanted Nessie. I don't really care. I'm not gonna play much. So. Okay, what is plugged into what here? Being smelly and hairy, nice. Are you Sasquatch? Are you actually Sasquatch? I'm doing all right. Um, trying to set up my stupid PlayStation capture card, which has decided not to function at the moment. Um, when moment, I went to press the screen. I think that's what it is. There we go. Perfect. Bigfoot's another dead team. Mm -hmm. Is that Big Man's team? I guess that would make sense that Big Man gets Bigfoot. <laughs> uh, Alright. Uh, let's see. Um, I don't remember what I was saying <laughs> about blood level four. Oh yeah. Um so far, it's actually gone pretty smoothly. It was not intended to be a challenge run at all. It's peer pressured into this. Um, throwing, throwing derp under the bus. But we're going to see how far we can get before it gets too tedious. I don't think I will do a complete run, especially because of the DLC. I actually think I can probably get Ludwig BL4. I have fought Ludwig so many times. He is my all-time favorite boss in the series, but the other three, like, try I'm just thinking of trying to do Living Failures BL4. I don't think I would ever want to do that. That sounds like fucking agony. She's, she's doing great. She's doing great. Did you alt F4? Oh, yeah, I always, I always fuck up that thing. One of these times my save file is going to disappear and the game's going to be like, I told you so. I done told you so. I started also listening to a five hour audiobook recording of Bloodborne lore on YouTube. There's a, there's a, an essay someone wrote years ago that I never got around to reading because it was like 40 pages long or something called The Pale Blood Hunt, which is a... a some sort of dissection of the lore and someone actually made an audiobook of it and put it on YouTube so I've been listening to like 10 minutes at a time um when I'm doing other stuff Doo -doo -doo. did you unplug your house my house <laughs> what <laughs> what <laughs> games are just asking for all f4 when they make you load the menu yeah before exiting I think all the FromSoft games do that I think this one does if yeah, return to title menu. I don't know why they do it that way. Yeah, I think it's I think it's just a FromSoft thing. <laughs> Very annoying. Elden Ring was that way too, and then you get fucking flashbanged in the title screen half the time. <laughs> um, okay. So what we're gonna do today is try Dark Beast Parl. Um I'm gonna upgrade my weapon again because I got I ran into the DLC in a panic and got some chunks and I think I have enough to upgrade <laughs> again. And this is fair game. I don't know. I, again, I have not looked up any BL4 strategies or anything. I know people use beast blood pellets. I've never used beast blood pellets for anything because I get hit too much. Um, but I'm assuming like in BL4 you get one shot most of the time, so that's why people use them. Doesn't matter. Oh, when it's time to go, it's time to go! FromSoft did not get the memo on that. Um, but yeah, I want to try to to at least see Parl so I can go through the 
uh, old Yarnum without getting shot to death. Pennant of Vicar Amelia used to change into a blood jam. This pennant passed down among the vicars who head the healing church as a reminder of the cautionary adage, words that will open the gate. Organworth. Ooh. What's this? I don't know if this gem is any good. Usually the starry ones didn't seem very good. I forget all the gem stuff. That's better than nothing. Okay. Um, I don't have any money. I have 60. Okay. This is just... A plus seven, a plus seven weapon, though, against Bloodstar Beast and Parl. Is that stupid busted? <laughs> I might wait. I think it's really busted against Bloodstar Beast. He might just fucking kill over if I go in with a plus seven weapon. Um. I guess you get- how do you get to part- you get abducted by the sack man, I think? It's been 84 years. Think you go to the cathedral ward and you get punched by the sack man? Oh, you know what I want? I don't- I don't know what I want. For Parl. Just in case. Ooh. Also, when do I get to buy fire paper? <laughs> That would help. Um, this has good bolt resistant on resistance on it on the chest piece. Even though it's ugly as sin. So I think I might for that. Is it chocolate? Oh, I would love some chocolate right now. <laughs> Refresh out. So this is the guy we murdered last time. Uh, Eileen was hunting him because I guess he lost his shit. Hunter's attire worn by Henrik, the old hunter. Tac taciturn old hunter Henrik was once partners with Father Gascoigne, and though they were a fierce and gallant duo, their partnership led to Henrik's tragically long, long life. Henrik's unique yellow garb is resistant to bolt and will be of great help to any hunter who has inherited the onus of the hunt. Now, this outfit's hideous, but if I'm gonna not die to Pearl, <laughs> I think I should just get the whole set. I have enough. Cause... He do big lightning damage. And I don't trust myself to, s to stagger him. How much lightning rats does this give? All together? Three sixteen, that's pretty good. I think that's the best we can do. Electric Carl. <laughs> that outfit is certainly no dino sweater. It, it sure isn't. It's not too bad. Not too bad looking at it. Now, Dimmy cooking what you eating, Risu? What are you eating? Also, Risu, do, to get to Parl, do I get hit by the sack man? Can you remind me, please? Do I let the man hit me with his sack and I'm talking to me? Hi, Mug Monster. How you doing? <laughs> we'll be having fried sh shrimp. Oh, heck yeah. Against this boy. Yahar Ghoul. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Time to get sacked. Let's go. Yeah. Is this boss the giant silverfish? It Who's the giant silverfish, Ron? I'm trying to think of a silverfish. This is the uh, the Tim Burtony looking skeleton dog. I don't know how to describe. What is Parl? He's like a skeleton beastie. Your Bloodborne and Doom Figma arrived today. Oh, very nice. I hope they uh, are just what you wanted. Hope the quality is acceptable. Be gentle with the Bloodborne one. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking from experience, it's very fragile. That's wrong. Oh, you heard fried shrimp. No, no, I'm gonna be the fried shrimp because the uh, boss is gonna fry us. Hmm. 
Is this a picture of it? Very nice. Oh, you got pyramid head too. Nice. You got it to stand without the stand. Mine always falls over. <laughs> That's awesome. They're good looking figures for the price. They're just fragile. He's here, right? Sack man. Whoa. I thought the sack man was here. Where's the sack man? Oh. <laughs> Is it in this corner? Nope. Man, what's the girl gotta do to get abducted around here? Where is he? <laughs> I thought he was here. <laughs> oh, I'm not looking forward to Rom at all. Only silverfish you can think of are the ones in the school. Yeah, that's what I was thinking of the, uh, like, centipede looking things. Is there another boss? The first change. So I did Gascoigne, Cleric Beast, and Vicar Amelia. Thank you, Panda. <laughs> the stands are convenient, but you only accept posing them without. It's a good challenge. Good challenge. Yeah, we're just the man, right? I thought the man's was here. So what is there another way to Parl other than Yahargul? Because you definitely can hit up Parl before you hit up old Yarnum, which is what I'm trying to do so I can make friends with Jura. They show up after BSV, so how do you get to Parl? Otherwise, you definitely can do it, because that's how you don't aggro Jura. So what's the what's the way? No one does this on their own. Everyone must have had to consult a guide for this Jura thing. I just want to talk to Jura. You'll have to go till you get to Yahar Ghoul the other way? But what is the other way? Like, where do I start? My brain can't orient where it is. What, is it even this lantern? This game is a maze. It's amazing, but it's also a maze. Significantly later. So that means you gotta do Forbidden Woods first? Hit Shadows of Yarnum, and then you go back to Blood Starved Beast and you just shit dump it because you're over <laughs> like you're overpowered? Is after ROM? Is that the only way? That seems busted. The other way is yeah, maybe climbing cathedral ward. I think there is another way, Zabek. I think I like I'm, I'm, my brain is just putting together another way, but I don't know how to get there. <laughs> It's, I, I, I understand, there's the other, uh, this is Cathedral War, right? There's the, the one that connects here, right? That loops back around, but where does, where do you get there? <laughs> is that up on the left? Because this gate isn't open. I think it's, I think it's whatever connects back to that gate there. But I forget how to get there. Do you get to start going towards Old Yarnum? Is it up through here? Help. <laughs> I gotta watch a YouTube video. You need a key that goes to Upper Cathedral? Oh, it does! Oh, oh and you get that later, right? And that's where, um, Umbria does this? I think? There's so many optional areas. And then there's, uh, there's, uh, Castle Canehurst? That I totally forget, other than I know you get the summons by going through... Forbidden woods in a weird way. Oh, they sleep in. So, is it up this? Is it another like branch off of here or down here? I don't. I just brain. Hi, Skelly. What's up? Brain. I think it's up here to the left, right? And there's like some whole maze over here, like behind this man. I guess this way. Which means it's probably not this way. Not much. I'm doing. I'm doing all right, Skelly. We're trying to figure out progression. I'm trying to. I'm trying to get to uh, Parl. <laughs> if there is a way 
to get to Barl. <laughs> you beat up Vicarmelia? I did. It was like my third try, fourth try. Which was super easy. How's it going, Eric? These guys are the worst. No, not the crow. I knew that was gonna happen. My inside! No. He's slurping my brain. Wait, did that. Did he take two insight? This motherfucker. Yeah, you can tell me, Parl. I'm, I'm just lost. <laughs> I'm glad I spent my insight. <laughs> Some of it. After Rome or after BSP? Is it? I swear I went like before BSP and before ROM, but I can't mentally figure out how to get there. Maybe I'm misremembering. That's very possible. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get to Parl, if it's possible, before beating the Blood Surf Beast. And before progressing past Amelia. Yeah, if there's- if you know there's another way, Eric? Okay, yeah, that guy's not there yet, so that's what I was looking for. He's not there yet. <laughs> Is that the only other way? I thought you could walk. Snatchers don't spawn until after you kill the Bloodstarved Beast. When you first see Parl, it resets Jury's hostility. Then you can either kill Parl or die to him. And then approach him from behind. Okay. So what you're saying is you can clear out old Yarnum and then see Parl and then go back? I think I just want to wait on old Yarnum. I'm kind of not feeling it right now. <laughs> Even if it'll make Bloodstar Beast really easy, I never really had too much trouble with him to begin with. Um, but I kind of want to leave that as a side project because I think the shadows of Yarnum are going to turn me a new butthole. Um, so I don't know where I'm going right now. <laughs> I think this is the way, right? To the Forbidden Woods. Did I get the password? I think I did when I touched the skull. Oh, oh. good to see you safe. Now, let's think up something to discuss. Just tell me what piques your interest. Ah, I can't remember if I talked I about want these. To tell you. A bit of wisdom from the eminent master Lugarius. Once, a scholar betrayed his Fear fellows by at Bergamot. And brought forbidden blood back with him to Canehurst Castle. It was there that the first of the inhuman vile bloods was born. The vile bloods are fiendish creatures who threaten the purity of the church's blood healing. The ruler of the vile bloods is still alive today. And so, to honor my master's wishes, I search for the path to Canehurst Castle. It talks about the other stuff. I bid you farewell. May the good blood. Thanks. Eat that guy, but the wheel is so cool. It is. It is. I forget how you get that too. Do you have to finish his quest? Excuse me. It also gets you access to challenge dungeons and necessary for any cum dungeon farmer. That's very true. We won't be able to check out the cum dungeon until we we kill the bluster beast. I don't think we need to, unless we get really stuck on vials. Man, this this is probably my absolute least least favorite area of the game. Is I don't know about you guys. You guys have a least favorite area because I think this has to be mine. Is the Forbidden Woods? I get so lost here. It's a bunch of poisonous snakes. There's the fucking shadows of Yarnum. Like the this, I just word. dread this area. Bastard. <laughs> Is he- is he good? You good? <laughs> he 
it just keeps going if you don't press any. <laughs> You're doing well. I'm doing all right. Thanks. Doing all right. Had a pretty, pretty uh, unproductive day, but this is where the rifle spear is. Leave breadcrumbs. <laughs> not here. Oh, our old Yarnum. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I'm probably not gonna use it at this point anyway, but that's good to know. Woods is too big. You don't like it. Woods and Canehurst suck only areas. Oh, you don't like Canehurst? What about Canehurst don't you like? I thought the design was cool. Here are the old blood. He's already dead, guys. Shocker. <laughs> I just love the caption. He's already dead. Freshly dead. Okay, it's time. So, oh man, this is gonna be rough. <laughs> like, I'm probably, I've been trying to kind of not sprint through stuff, but this area I feel like uh, kind of warrants that. Too big with loaded HP enemies. Oh yeah, the run sucks. That's true. That's the one that's up on the rooftops, right? Forbidden Woods was horrifying. I was taught I distinctly remember. Like it it's spooky. It's definitely very spooky, but the free like it's kind of funny at the same time. Like I distinctly remember talking to Twitch chat and just like reading the chat, and as I was distracted, there was just a snake like slowly like <laughs> creeping up. <laughs> and I got jump scared. Because <laughs> it just slowly crept up. They just like very slowly aggro the whole time. What is um is that Yarnum? Is that just, just Yarnum from a different side? It looks very cool. This area is also very troll with that one trap that like swings down. I I remember that as well. Because I died to it. The the log spike log. <laughs> I think it's on the bridge or past the bridge. Yeah, it's like right there, past the bridge, there's a spike log. For the vials, nerd. You like how the wood sleeps back? Yeah, that's the part I'm gonna. I might need some guidance remembering how to do the loop back to get the caner's summons. I remember you gotta. You gotta go back to the uh, starting area. Dine is ready. Wait, did you say what you were eating, Risu? I don't remember. You probably did. I probably missed it. Like left at Albuquerque. Okay, where is that relative to Yarn? <laughs> oh. This this area also has two shortcuts, right? At least. There's like two elevators. So I remember this one pops open last, and there's some dude in there. Vulture. Maybe. Ah. Really no reason to fight the oh, maybe there is a reason to fight these people. Oh shit. Oh, okay, very good. Should probably equip those considering the snake problem in the area. It doesn't look like you have full HP sometimes, even when you do. Okay. Antidotes. Where? I just passed them. The antidotes set. Uh, you can't buy these, so these are precious. I'm pretty sure you can't buy them yet. Pasta with fake meat bits. One edamame! Nice! Do you just like buy bulk edamame? Well since I'm going here and not against Pearl, I'm gonna change back to my regular outfit because I like it better. Let's put the regular boots and stuff on. Gloves. That's the look. 
Are those the boots I was wearing before? I don't think those are. Maybe. There's someone running. It's already dead, but it's still moving! It's creepy! I think it was dudes. Yeah, that's the look. The spooky monster man? Which one? The one with the snake exploding out of its head? Usually get the pre shells the last time you accidentally bought five bags in the shells, even if I'm in a shell them all. It's it's meditative, Risu. You just you know, get home from work, unwind from a rough day by shelling a pound of edamame. Fucking <laughs> Preggers. Preggers is actually a very appropriate emote for Bloodborne, unfortunately. Do you like summoning other hunters? Uh, not when I'm doing a playthrough. I do for like, if I'm bored. Oh no. <laughs> As I step back. <laughs> I, I, I like felt that before I even saw there was a clip there. <laughs> Gravity again. Um. Like, I, I did a ton of, um, when I first played years ago, did a ton of Chalice Dungeons. The cursed, fetid, defiled, whatever. The challenging Chalice Dungeons with, with friends. Um, and did some boss co-op and stuff, but if I'm, like, trying to get through a run on my own, I don't usually summon. Plus, I'm BL4, so anyone I summoned would also be very low level <laughs> and probably get one shot. Which is not a good time. Oh! Oh, he died too. <laughs> okay, noted. Noted. <laughs> oh, the suspicious beggar is here? Wait, can you make him- Does he turn into abhorrent beast here? I can't remember. I like fighting abhorrent beasts, but not on the rafters. I liked him in the chalice dungeons. She summoned me once, she didn't have a boss to fight, she just made me clean for an hour before she would let me summon- <laughs> imagine? I'd love to summon, summon someone to clean. If you attack him, he does- Oh, I might do that, because he's an asshole. The only reason this is hard is because of this guy with a gun. I can't get hit. I can't get hit! <laughs> All right, so it was really easy <laughs> up until now. Viscera cleanup detail Bloodborne DLC. I have to, if I'm not running, I actually have to systematically dispatch of these guys. Because I, I can only take two hits, apparently. It's, it's reached that point. <laughs> Guess we'll do it that way. Can't be as reckless as I'd like to be. Okay. There we go. You took like two damage from getting shot. Yeah, the, the guns are not really guns. Like they're just there for parrying. They don't, they barely do damage unless you build around it. And even then you do better <laughs> for your trip to Merka. Uh, the, the old Yarnum sweaty clothes. It's like a BB gun. <laughs> Old yarn and sweaty clothes. Alright, so I remember this. Peppered Farm remembers that you don't step on the boards or you eat shit because there's a big log with spikes on it that comes down and hits you. Sorry if anyone was waiting for that. I might not remember much, but I remember that. Very, very clearly. Seared into my memory. Okay. It's the it's the use to get to special again. Is that just death down there? Is that just death? I can't remember. Looks kind of weird down there. Oh, away! Away! Who's speaking? Someone's speaking. Creepy. Someone's whispering like creepy sweet nothings up there. 
You were waiting, I bet you were. You know, you know everything about Bloodborne. The wheelchair guy, yeah, he did. I didn't remember him though. I didn't remember the wheelchair guy. Your curse, you'll fuck you. Ah! <laughs> I didn't remember the dogs. Good lord, everything's everything hurts. Everything hurts all the time. <laughs> In this game, when you're level four. That's <laughs> everything hurts. We're finished, I hear you. We're fi we're finished, where are you? Oh, he's right there, he's just like, we're finished. Hi. See, the thing is, sir, I can, I can just walk up to you and do this. Ow, yo, he just punches you. <laughs> they don't know. I was going for the side stab. You miss clicking. But you miss clicking. The Charlie squishing? That's a lot of bullets. Oh, the pin message thing. <laughs> yeah. I can't tell if you're doing it to like meme sometimes or if it's to miss click. <laughs> Look at this noob just stepping in the fire. Even before I die stepping in the fire. You saw your message being pinned? <laughs> Just pin the pin that you hate the pins. <laughs> Twitch has added a lot of features, and some of them are good. Like I can see that being useful in certain circumstances. But most of the time, I think people it just annoys people. Yeah, they're very clunky the way they implemented it. Also, the watch streak thing. I don't. What do you guys feel about the watch streak? Like, I, I, if I'm happy that people are watching, but it's, it's just kind of like funny. Yeah, it's it's all awkward. Why is this red and spooky? Like, what is this? The spooky tomb lighting. Is this normal? Is this a bug? Why is it glowing? Yeah, I saw, I saw you did that, Risu, and that's a good use of it. It was an example of a good use, so she didn't have to answer it 500 times that she beat Melania. <laughs> New pop-up for lurkers to accidentally click and identify themselves as a lurker. How embarrassing. Look at this. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for the flex, Toodles. <laughs> Look at these lanterns! Le the freaking the level design in this game, so good. Like, it just looks so organic. I don't know if there's a good way to describe it. You know, you guys know what I mean? Like organic in that it looks like something that would natural naturally occur. Like the way the things are growing, it, it looks not copy pasted like a lot of games do. Handcrafted. Which makes it more uh, immersive, I think. You love Blood Bloodborne's design. The other games don't really... I don't think they compare in the design. Eld Elden Ring had some areas that were really cool, but... Overall, Bloodborne is pretty consistent. Come here. Oh, I don't like... I don't like this at all. There's a guy to the left. How do we do this? I think we pebble. This is... BL4, this is scary as fuck, guys. <laughs> I didn't anticipate this. BL4 is probably better when you know how to run through an area. BL4, if you haven't played in forever, this is terrifying. Like, because I don't know how to approach things, so I can't just sprint through them. It doesn't work. Or I'll just get lost. Oh no! <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna have to plink away at them one by one. It's the only way. I think there's dogs here too that rush out. I 
gonna sneak up on this guy. You can fall in the middle. It's, there's like a gentle scraping noise in the back that sounds like the axe scraping when someone chases you. That keeps triggering me. This man just punching! <laughs> no fear. Bro just punching. Like, what is that scraping? I don't know if you guys can hear that. It's very subtle. I have this sound way up on my end. Did they take away that feature where you pay one thirty nine ninety nine Canadian dollar on your chat message? I think so, Toodles, because I've never seen people use that. You still want to finish Elden Ring, but you're taking a break. Definitely seems like the type of game that it's a good idea to take a break from. I made the mistake of not doing that, um, but it's a big game. I have to give up that level of design. Yeah, yeah, there's no way to make the whole world that handcrafted. That's why the legacy dungeons were cool. Fins feel kind of prone to singling people out. Oh, like putting you on display. Hey, Charlie. Red did, did a good job. You remember the sound. What's up, derp? How you doing? You she didn't binge is so, so hard, same. I don't think I would have enjoyed it much more, but it, it would have been a different experience not binging it. You're in a fugue state. <laughs> yeah, you were playing it a lot, I remember. Carrying seems very important to the BL4 experience. Considering how I got two shot by the guys at the start of the woods, this is where it gets real, I'm pretty sure. Now, did we get all of them? I think we did. Is there a rune in here? No. <laughs> what I'm remembering. Okay. So that was all just for some pungent piece of blood, blood cocktails. This really is feeling like a first playthrough in some ways, with how terrified I am of absolutely everything at every given moment. <laughs> He's just taking his sweet time getting up. I'm gonna capitalize on that. But yeah, I, I do wonder with Elden Ring if they had just cut the size of the game down. If that would have worked out. Because I would have been fine with it, but where they were billing it as an open world, some people might have been like, this game's way too small to be an open world. I don't know what they were talking about. Hello? I think if I get shot once, it's like three quarters of my health bar. Which is fun and exciting. Is there a way in this house? No. So there is a gate back up here. I don't know. There it goes. Oh, where am I? <laughs> I don't know where I am. Oh, beast bows will come in handy. That I'm gonna be duping my save, probably, for Shadows of Yarnum if I'm super stuck. Shadows of Yarnum, I never really figured out even on normal playthroughs, so I don't I don't know how this one's gonna go. <laughs> we'll see. This might be the wall. At the end of the day, somebody's gonna be mad no matter what they do. That's very true. Yeah, I'm curious with the DLC what they'll do, because they got plenty of feedback from people. Usually their DLCs are incredible. Like, I have a feeling it'll probably be pretty good, but also, how are they going to make it difficult enough because people have that built-in expectation that the DLC is a whole nother level of difficulty? Even when that might be uh, kind of unfun.
These guys are so easy to hurry. <laughs> Now, does this double back to a shortcut? Let's find out. Because I don't remember. Shadows of Yarnum sounds like a fanfic title. I mean, it could be. It's like a. There's three of them. It could be a, a, a menage a trois fanfic. <laughs> there probably is Rule 34 of the Shadows of Yarnum. So. Hold up. Hold, hold up. What is it? What? Ooh! So, the Beast Blood Pellet, what is the lore? Because there do be a lot of Beast Blood Pellets here. Large medicinal pellets, supposedly formed of coagulated Beast Blood, banned by the Healing Church due to their unclear origin. Grants a spurt of beasthood. Oh, baby. Ripping apart the flesh of one's enemies and being rained upon by their splattering blood invigorates one's sense of beasthood, feeding strength and euphoric feeling alike. Nice. What's up, uh, Capitan? Crimp, how you doing? Hello, the hello. How do you do, fellow masochists? How you doing tonight? Welcome on in. This is uh, this is definitely a masochist uh, safe zone stream. Though we're not playing Neo, that's like extra masochism when we do. It's just Melania again, but she has a chain gun. It's not poop. Unless it's beast poop. Hold up. Well, I turned around and now I'm just incredibly disoriented. <laughs> I mean, this might come as a surprise to people, but I'm lost. So you can't go up further. You just go this way. Let's go up. That was the beast blood. Don't you played me out! It's too late. Did you play it again, Risu, after I played it? <laughs> You're like, man, I can't, can't, can't believe this. Did you, like, f do another full playthrough? I can't believe she did this. So there's no other- this is just a dead end. You played it more. Okay. That's fine. And go through a whole nother playthrough. Oh, hold up. Hold up. Let's just loose back around. Okay, this is a maze. This is at this area is actually a nightmare. <laughs> Neo does make it feel like there's nothing you can do. Sometimes, yeah, it's it's guess I'll die, the game. Like <laughs> specific areas. Um, it's not a bad game. It's it's different, but the level design is punishing in a way that's different from the FromSoft games from the bit of it I played before I rage quit. It is a long game. It's also not Neo 2, which I, everyone would not shut up about it being better. Did you like the newer Kirby game? It was amazing. It's a very good Kirby game. Um, but it's also $60 and it was like, it took me like seven hours to beat it, so. I don't know if that's a deciding factor, if anyone's looking to purchase it. Is there something down here other than just the pit? Yeah, there is. Are there dogs down here? Gross. I remember there being something down here, but I couldn't remember what type of beastie exactly. This one's still alive. They're always like one hit more than I think they should be. Oh, it's worth it for the antidotes. Those are hard to come by. This part of the game. It's nice of them to put a ladder in the pit. In the death pit. What is the point of this? <laughs> Professional Kirby player. Oh, heck yeah. With how many times we died to gravity. You spend too much time watching Twitch and working and stuff to actually play games. Yeah, def definitely not a professional Kirby player. <laughs> this place is awesome. Everyone was just raving about it. Resuit. That's a good one. I can't. I can't fault you on that one. That was a good one. Is there anything back up there, guys? Does that just loop back around? There's a the shortcuts. Not that way. Oh, is this where you get the tonsil stone? I think this is where you get the tonsil stone, right? Oh, it's- oh! The way I'm going now or the way I was going through the gate? I fell into the pit. I haven't watched... Um... Whatchamacallit? Parks and Rec in a long, long time. 
That's one of those shows that's like, I wonder how this show has aged. But Aubrey Plaza is always great. Oh, Up and to the left? Through the gate? Risu? <laughs> or, or, like, this way? Okay, so... Towards the lantern is the tonsil stone. Through the gate, is this the way back to get the summons? Or tonsil stone direction. So those who are just getting here, I, ha I've, I have 500 hours in this game. <laughs> but I haven't played in four years and I haven't watched anything. So uh, it's been exciting. It's like a first playthrough, basically. Oh, a hunter of beasts, are you? Glory be, you know not the value you possess. But more's the pity. The hours of the night are many, and the beasts, more than I can count. A veritable hunt unending. Not even death offers solace, and the blood imbibes you. <laughs> A most frightful fate. Oh my. But I'm willing to do you a Would you kindly give me a tonsil stone? Step lightly round to the right of the great cathedral and seek an ancient shrouded church. The gift of the godhead will grant you strength. Yes, I'm unquestionably certain. So this is the thing that you let the amygdala pick you up and then it brings you to the swamp shithole? Is that the thing? <laughs> it's my favorite game of all time, by the way. <laughs> a latticed, deformed rock. Or perhaps a meteorite. Appears useless, but possesses some odd gravitational force that prevents its riddance. A dubious soul once said, Step lightly to the right of the great cathedral. That's what he just said. He's the dubious soul. I don't know if he'd, he'd appreciate that item description. Well. Didn't know you could do that. Is there another one? You, another one you can get somewhere? There's gotta be one that's not in the cage. Nightmare Frontier, oh, or the Academy. Okay. The Canehurst Invite is past those on the left. Okay, so we are going the right way. So that other gate is just kind of nothing. You can get it for multiple windows. Weird. There's so many weird little things to this game that are very easy to miss. I think there's a man up here. There's a man over there too. It's about time to die, because I haven't found a shortcut and I have almost 20,000 echoes, so... You know, it's about, about, time, about that time. To just fucking die. To a crow or something. Say, level 4. Ooh! Garb. Love me some garb! Can I read the garb without get, getting crowed? Pyre of Special Church Doctors. These doctors are superiors to the black preventative hunters and specialists in experimentally backed blood minis- in experimentally backed blood administration and the scourge of the beast. They believe that medicine is not a means of treatment, but rather a method for research, and that some knowledge can only be obtained by exposing oneself to sickness. Interesting. So that's on a rooftop here, which is implying they were doing some sort of experimentation here. Or else why would that be there? The other gate takes you back to the entrance. Is there... there's probably the shortcut there then. I just didn't see it. Um... There's a spooky man standing on there. What's up there, friend? A body garb? I need a bodyguard going through here. <laughs> oh. You think you always get the tonsil stone next to the first lamp in the game? You maybe have a fire gun thing? Oh, from Gilbert? Does he give one? 
It's just the way to get into this area without- Oh, without falling. Oh, okay. Baby shark. Are you okay, Toodles? Or Toodles, are you having a, a mental breakdown? <laughs> Everything alright? Toodles is breaking into baby shark. I'm worried. Concerned. No! I didn't R1 match fast enough. No! I was R1 mashing so fast, guys, but I think I ran out of stamina. I should have L1. Well, I just can't, just can't not pay attention. Ugh. Baby shark, do 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 do. Baby shark, do 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 do. Baby shark. Well, I guess we're running. Those are definitely gone, by the way. Like, I'm level four, those are coming back. <laughs> But the thing is, like, I only really need them for vials anyway, so it doesn't feel bad losing them. When I do inevitably lose them. Because I'm not, uh, saving up to level up. Alright, let's play. Try to fucking brain navigate where we just were. And f forget. <laughs> She's, she's packing. I, I believe you, Toodles. I believe you. This is a damn curse. I love the scraping axe noises. Really, really good for my anxiety. <laughs> this this whole area is just like a fucking nightmare. It's not even the nightmare. But it is a nightmare. Okay. We did it. We did it, chat. We did it. Now we just have to not die again. No! It's fucking dogs! God, I fucking hate dogs in this game. Just to, just to clarify, I like I like dogs IRL, but I'm stuck. I knew it. I was rolling. Ah. I'm about to molotov these dogs. I'm a, I'm about to actually molotov these fucking dogs. I'm so mad at them. Yeah, I was I was facing the wrong direction when I was button mashing. And then I decided to roll it. The thing that's tripping me up the most, honestly, it's not the health, it's the stamina. I you have such a small stamina bar, I cannot wait to get the uh the stamina rune. I just have a smidge more stamina. That would help significantly with my button mashing. But the other thing is the button mashing vision seems to be particularly effective in BL4. That's <laughs> what we're learning. A button mashing habits, which has uh, been particularly effective at normal levels, do not seem to be working. Whee. Do not chase me, poppers, or I'm gonna do a hoopers, cause I'm gonna be scared. They're still chasing me, oh no. Oh fuck. Please stop! Please de aggro. Please de aggro. Please de aggro. What the fuck? You gonna die to these guys? They just hit so hard. Like, even the little weenie enemies. It just takes two hits and I die. Fucking terrifying. Okay. Salvaged. You think any action game with quadrupedal enemies, they will always be the worst? Why? Because of the way they design them, or they always seem to be particularly fast and aggressive. At least in these games. Oh. Thanks. 
<laughs> so what made this an accidental BL4 run? Um, someone jokingly challenged me to it in chat, and I said, okay, we'll see how far we get. Basically, I started off and I'm like, we're gonna do an amygdala arm, amygdala arm run, because I've never used that weapon. It was derp. It was derp. I wasn't trying to sing to you, but it was derp. <laughs> Um, but I was gonna use the amygdala arm because I've never used it and I thought it would be fun. Um, but this is this is good too. This is good. It definitely is an interesting challenge. I don't know if I'm gonna finish a BL4 run, but I'm still trying to see how far we can get as someone who never got good to uh, even get to Amelia was pretty good. Wait, hold up. Just the ladder. Man, I really wish I had that almost 20,000 echoes right about now to buy some vials. That would be swell. That dog just ended my whole career. Have you done a BL4, Captain Crew? Uh, who here has done a BL4? I'm curious. Or any of the like SL1 whatever's. Oh, Beast, Beast War. A furry ability. Beast war. Where is it? Here? One of the forbidden hundred tools made by irreverent Izzy. Borrow the strength of the terrible undead dark beasts, if only for a moment, to blast surrounding foes back with the force of a roaring beast. The indescribable sound is broadcast with the caster's own vocal cords, which begs the question, what terrible things lurk deep within the frames of men? Can become a wolf -a -boo. You threw in the towel at Ludwig, the one-shots- Yeah, the DLC bosses at BL4 seem very intense. I haven't really watched a ton of challenge runs or anything, but I've I've heard people complaining about them in particular. Ludwig and uh Kals. Orphan of Calls. Did the main game well just just doing the main game at BL4 is impressive on its own. The DLC is like if you're extra masochistic, that uh, I think that's the one of the ones I go for, but even just doing the base game is good. I did say wolf -a boo Did you see the thing I got? I got a, a hunter's tool that lets you roar like a wolf. Is it this way? What's this gate? Did you equip? No, I'm, I'm too stupid to use it. I think it's arcane. I didn't go to school. I didn't go to wizard school. It's just the way back. BL for Lawrence, yeah, yeah, I've heard that's the worst one. I forgot to mention that one, but yeah. <laughs> I have heard the horror stories about him. He's bad enough on a regular leveled run. Is it up through here? Wait, it loops back around, right, to get to the... This is, a, this is an actual question if anyone wants to step in. Is it this way? How do you get to the, um... It's this way, right? Okay, never mind, I figured it out. <laughs> it's this way. I'm just trying to get back to, uh, get the Kanger summons. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Okay. Just want to make sure I'm on the right way. This is a poison swamp, too, isn't it? Oh, boy. wonder what these flowers are. I think they're in the Chalice Dungeon, too. The is Chalice Dungeons with the alien stuff. I vaguely remember those things being there. More antidotes! Yeah, sometimes just asking it gets your brain. Gets your brain in thinking mode. You have another friend who always figures things out. Yeah, some people like talking things out. I do sometimes, and then people jump in and backseat, but that's fine. We've already played it for the most part. But, um. Actually, I'll say, okay, I'm out. Help. <laughs> Help. Twitch chat, go find sexy criminal nurse. She's creepy. Oh god. Alright, I don't remember any of this other than pain. 
so I think we're gonna die here. Um, is it worth getting that? Whatever that is. Oh my god. Nope. 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 Slow poisoning my ass. Dirty blood. Ah, there's leeches. I forgot about the leeches. <laughs> ah! Is there anything in here that's worth getting? <laughs> this is awful. <laughs> Frenzied cold blood. Okay, that's pretty good. What are these guys doing down here? What the guys do? And there's just like leeches and these like troll guys with bells. Ah! Oh no, he reached! I'm dead. <laughs> Help. <laughs> I didn't think he would reach. Okay, well, I don't know what's in there, but it's probably not worth anything. We can check it on the way back. Leech jerky. Mmm. <laughs> Tastes like blood. You can make jerky out of a lot of things. You can make fruit jerky. You can sell it for like two bucks at Whole Foods for a small piece. It's great. Resistance rune? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's not really... I mean, maybe in VL4? I don't know. What it... I guess people probably use the stamina runes most in VL4. Nothing else in here? Spooky scary skeletons. What what happened to them? Why are there a bunch of charred bodies here? Is this where they dump the rejects? I don't know how people play this game without the lantern. It's so dark. The hand lantern. Yeah, this looks so cool. The art design is just so good in this game. Oh, Wolfaboo! Alright. Just making sure we're not missing anything. I don't think there's anything. You're go yeah, Hand Lantern was an Elden Ring. It's like reuniting with an old friend. You're here. I'm a lantern. And here we are. But someone's here now. Stomping around. It almost looks like... Is it... It's not snowing, right? What is the uh, stuff in the starlight? It's like ash. There used to be a skip to get over here at the beginning of the game, but they fixed it and you took that personally. Yeah, I bet a lot of speedrunners are uh, pissed when they fix skips. I could go back and just play- maybe I'll just go back and buy some, uh, buy some vials while we're here. Wait, there's no, uh, there's no lantern in here, right? You gotta go all the way up to the central yarn and lantern. I don't remember if there's a spawning place lantern. <laughs> Dong. Gotta go up the ladder. Don't hit my shins, please, sir. You need to have the first werewolf to its special grab attack and it'll push you through the gate. It'll take you hours of tries. Yeah, that doesn't sound very useful for uh, most people, right? Unless you just really, really want to go that way early. Sequence break everything. I can imagine that bug in the game out in a lot of ways, given how they want you to beat certain uh, bosses. Oh yeah, I didn't talk to Gilbert recently. That's a good idea. I'm gonna just buy some blood vials, because we're gonna need a lot of them. I'll probably spend my insight. What do you mean? Maybe I should just, you know, I'm I'm just gonna level up my weapon to plus seven because fuck the shadows of Yarnum. <laughs> I was gonna 
keep it at plus six because I didn't want Bloodstar Beast to be too easy when we eventually go that way, but I fucking hate the Shadows of Yarnum, and I know I'm gonna struggle, so we're just gonna we're gonna upgrade it. Hey, so much popsicle! What type of popsicle you got, Risu? Did you bring it off for the Twitch chat? The entirety of Twitch chat? It is done. Strawberry! Sounds good. Strawberry popsicle. Oh yeah, the <laughs> I forgot we we had our little uh little run through the DLC. We could go say hi to Ludwig. I feel like it's probably not a good idea to touch Ludwig until you have a plus 10 weapon, right? <laughs> I think it would probably be very questionable. Oh, there is a lamp there. I'm just oblivious. Speaking of the shadows, the only glitch used on this run was the AI break on Shadows of Yarnum, which was cathartic after trying to fight them normally for a few hours. What? How do you break them? I'm not gonna try anything like that. I'm just curious. Did you get any clues? No, not yet. Yet, as far as they can tell. Alright. Oh, it's still attached. I thought I... Thought I removed it. My bad. I got ice cream. I just remembered I got mint chocolate chip ice cream. Okay. So, where were we? Is there a graveyard here? It's just like casual graveyards all over the place in Yarno. There's a brain sucker here. Pretty sure there's a brain sucker. My brain suckers, yeah. This <laughs> is my brain sucker senses are tingling. These guys are the worst. Oh, I hate them. Think you can parry the grab? Cause I only have one insight to lose. You gonna attack, sir? You gonna you gonna attack? Okay. Up. Oh my god, I do no damage. Just do no damage. It's like nine damage <laughs> to this thing. Why is he so tanky? Where, where do I go to get up? This guy's giving me the heebie-jeebies. There's a letter up somewhere on this one. This guy. He's gonna trap me. Oh my god! These guys are the fucking worst. Where do I go? I thought there was a letter up, right? I'm just miss I'm just not seeing it. Oh, hold up. There it is. It's so dark. Letter blindness. You love their death metal pig scream? <laughs> the sound effects in this game are top notch. Oh, there's another trick where the last one gets stuck in a loop if you do it right and you can just do the same attack over and over until it dies. <laughs> Honestly, would not feel bad about doing that to Shadows of Yarnum. They're not, they're just like one of those bosses that's just an enemy that they put elsewhere later in the game. It's not very exciting. As a boss. There are a lot of crows up here, huh? Yeah. Wonder what brain juice tastes like. It's probably not very good. 
Is that a big stretch, Charlie? Oh yeah. Big stretch, followed by a slam face into the side of Cat Tree. It's a classic. We have gained insight. Okay. I love the, the gain insight noise. The spooky whispering. Brains are mostly fat. So you feel like it would be oily. Mmm. Wait, your brain's made out of fat? Okay, so I can kill this thing, right? Yeah, you don't you don't wanna get you don't wanna get the prion disease. I can I can kill the alien, right? Because she's already transformed. She's not like is it friendly? Are you friendly? Dubstep alien? Well then over here. I don't think it's friendly. Is it friendly? Cool. Oh yeah. Look at the disease. Okay, so this just goes right back down, right? It goes back down. So I could go to Kanehurst now if I wanted to. That doesn't sound like a good idea. <laughs> Seek pale blood to transcend the hunt. Hey, they wrote that downstairs too. So it does aggro if you get too close. I didn't touch it. It does have them chunks, that's true. That's true, but it's very spooky. <laughs> it's very- it's- the thing is that it'll be spooky no matter when I go there if I'm BL4, I guess. This is like a choose your own adventure and every choice is just agony. Hmm. Is there something else in here? Oh, is it wicked dark in here? It's kind of hard to see. Wicked dark. Remember there being- Oh yeah, the waifu. How did you worm your way in here? Well, I won't make any excuses. Would you mind leaving us alone? But if you refuse to leave... Oh well. I've always wanted to try my hand on a hunter. Do I have to do something special to her to get the... Is that the one that gives you the chunk of the umbilical? I can't re remember. I just don't want to fuck up the moon presence. <laughs> the last boss. Uh, what's up, RSJ? How you doing? Bail, come on and how's your week going? Just trying to remember Bloodborne things. Okay, you gotta wait till she's preggers, right? So if I go up here now, that'll fuck it up. Basically, don't engage her right now or she's gonna be pissed. <laughs> Bragger, yeah, <laughs> there's doodles. <laughs> okay, that's why I was saying that emo's too appropriate <laughs> for this game. This game is about pregnancy and birth, it's terrifying. That's why it's so scary. Okay, so we'll leave her alone with her weird alien baby until she's good and good and pregnant. Oh, no, wait, does it, it comes from this thing? That's where it is. Doing good, good to hear, RSJ. Communion. Ooh! Is this wounds? Does this give wounds? Yeah! I don't know, blood- Oh, this is even better! Blood file max! Heck yeah! I don't know if that's great for BL4, but I use this a lot on my regular playthrough. <laughs> a secret symbol left by Carol Runesmith of Bergenworth. Several runes relate to blood, including communion, which raises the maximum number of blood vials one may carry. This rune represents the healing church and its ministers. Blood administration is, of course, the pursuit of communion. So supposedly these runes are what Carol, who is one of the Bergenworth scholars, transcribed uh, based on her interpretation of what the Great Ones were trying to say. Since you can't exactly understand what they're saying because it's a bunch of gobbledygook. She'll be on a table when she's ready. Oh, yeah, and she's in some weird suggestive poses, isn't she? I vaguely remember. <laughs> 
I vaguely remember. What's up, dork? How you doing? What does all hit mean? What does it sound like it means? Take a guess. Do we get to punch a baby? <laughs> oh. Oh. Master Willem would have been proud of Carol's wound. Runes. Wounds. I said wounds. He would have been proud of her wounds. <laughs> oh. They didn't depend on the old blood. Yes. That was in The Pale Blood Hunt, the five-hour audiobook that I started listening to on YouTube. <laughs> the five-hour audiobook transcription of a 40-something page essay, I think it was. You will hit all enemy- no, 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 all enemy will hit me. <laughs> it's a play on uh, a common no challenge run that people do for Bloodborne, which is no hit, you don't get hit. I'm just getting hit all the time. <laughs> Okay, I don't think it was 40 pages. <laughs> I don't know how many pages. It was very long. Is there anything else in here? I think we did it. Now we gotta go back to the Forbidden Ones. Uh, it might be easier just to go to the lamp than backtrack all the way through the poison shithole. I'm guessing. But my brain cannot triangulate where the closest lamp is. <laughs> no, not up there. <laughs> What does pop time do? I know there's like kittens. It does kittens too, right? Because I saw that in Ellie's shot. It's like still a pop time bot, but it also applies to kittens. <laughs> what is the Preggers piano? <laughs> Keyboard Preggers. This is a nice view of Yarnum. I like the subtle fog. They, like, man, this game is just, it's so good looking still. It's still so rude, so good looking. This doesn't really need a remaster. Just please fucking port it. For the love of God, just port it. <laughs> That's so cute. How did I get... Then you may ask yourself, how did I get here? It was here. Oh, the brain guy is still down here, though. Yeah, the night changes as you get. Risu had a good point, though. It would have been nice if the... The night uh, took longer to change. Because it ends up most of the game being in, in the nighttime. It would have been nice to see a little more variety to it, but it does look cool. I like the moonlight a lot. Makes sense, because it's supposed to be the night. The night of the hunt. My god, what have I done? <laughs> okay, so there's a lamp down here somewhere. So we're gonna go home. We're gonna buy like two vials, two whole vials. I don't know how much they cost now. What could a blood vial cost, Michael? Five dollars? Uh, I think they're like 360 echoes at this point, but they just get worse. And maybe it's 540. They were counting on the changes from the insight, like the crying baby and the visible amygdala. Differentiate things later, and then it just get all crazy purple bright. True, true. And then the blood moon stuff. True. I really, oh man, the the insight mechanic again. I just wish they had fleshed that out more. It's so cool, like the potential for it. If it was on PC, someone could mod cool stuff in. Oh, excuse me. Okay, where is the forbidden woods? We going back in, back to the shithole. What's up, mom? Hold on, my mom sent me an essay. Hold on. One moment. Great, comma, thank you, exclamation point. She bought too many blueberries, she wants me to eat the blueberries. <laughs> The DLC sky- the DLC is probably one of the most beautiful looking uh, areas in a video game, like, full stop. I'm biased, again, this is my favorite game, but I think the design of that area and the way it's kind of collapsing in on itself is incredibly cool. Oh, guess I'll die. Who needs health? 
where we're going. Back to the lantern. That man do be chasing with an axe. Uh, he has an axe to grind. I hear it grinding on the ground. You want some extra blueberries, Archie? Okay, cool. Just, just uh, DM me your address. They'll be, they'll be to you in a week. They'll be blueberry juice by then. You ate all of the popsicles. <laughs> Diabetes free soup. You gonna get the beatus. Okay, so... Oh no, well guess I'll die. It's been real. His man's coming down the ladder. Okay, oh god! Oh Jesus! Oh god! <laughs> Wait, that's why the ladder's there. Oh, that's why it's there. Oh, okay, alright. Yeah. <laughs> It's like, why is this ladder here? That doesn't make sense. Why would they put that in the trap? People would just walk out of the trap. Think of all the antioxidants. Mmm, delicious. Delicious antioxidants. They're so colorful. Turley is conked out right now. I don't know how with all the screaming. This really is the first playthrough experience, and just running in terror from everything after figuring out the general direction of where to go, and also forgetting the general direction of where to go after figuring it out. Is this way faster? A foul beast! I don't even look like a beast. I'm, I'm looking at wearing people clothes. I haven't turned into like one of the- like they're just chilling with the- other guy that's definitely a beast. I don't have time to heal where we're going. <gasps> My butt clenched a little hearing the gunshot. There's still dogs. Oh, there's more dogs. Oh, <laughs> Camp. Why are. Oh, who let the dogs out? Who? Who? Who did it? <laughs> Someone let the dogs out. No! Someone actually let the dogs out. <laughs> Help! All right, this is a this is not this is not good. All right, am I safe from the dogs? Yo, this area sucks ass. This area sucks. There's just crazy dudes hucking molotovs. Stop! Jesus Christ! Quit it! Oh my God! There's, there's still so everyone's just hucking Molotovs over and over again. You're going upstairs because you're tired of being downstairs where you're cold. Okay, enjoy. Be upstairs. Just keep running. Stop running! No, you gotta run. I get one or two shot by everything on this map. You have to run. <laughs> there is no other way. And also, all of those men were hucking molotovs, and this whole area below is uh, oil. So you you know how that be? Can I go this way? That guy do be spitting poison. Oh, the dog! <laughs> How was that still following me the whole way? The dogs. I fucking hate the dogs in this game. <laughs> they just will not quit. And these aren't even the worst dogs. There are dogs in the chalice dungeons that, like, I think they have a grab attack and they spit fire. All of the dogs are terrible. I have died to the dogs more than... More than anything else, I think. <sighs> I'm not a chicken. I'm not a chicken. I'm very brave. Very brave, very powerful. I beat Vicar Amelia with no levels. This was not the way to go. That was not- that was not the way to draw. That was not the way... 
There's also the fact that I have a sliver of what your stamina bar should be at this point of the game, so running is very hard. Because <laughs> you effectively have to pump the stamina bar by sprinting, stopping, sprinting, stopping, sprinting, stopping for it to regen. You can't just sprint. So you have to time it very carefully when you're stopping, or you just eat shit. That's definitely the hardest part for me so far is the stamina management. You don't want a ton of stamina in Bloodborne in general, but having five extra points, which is what I normally have, does help. I normally have about 15. Or five extra points. Okay, this is- both ways suck! Both ways suck ass if you don't just run as fast as possible. I'm not gonna fight through all these guys again, because I already did. My goal is to kind of fight through each area once, unless it's the DLC. I don't think I'm gonna be able to fight through it. BL4, I'll probably just have to run. But it's hard. There's a reason people don't do BL4 their first playthrough. <laughs> and why it's not good for a de-resting. Um, if you don't remember where you're going, it's harder to know where to run. Quick enough to, uh get there without dying to everything you've aggroed. No, we're- no, everything- this is out of all the Soulsborne games, I think this one has the most oppressive atmosphere. It just feels like everything is out to get you constantly. I think it's because the levels, a lot of them are so kind of tight. Like, at a full sprint you almost get hit by all of those attacks. I don't even know if this is the way that I'm supposed to be going, but I'll cap off because the dogs are all out of their cages. If we go this way, maybe. Doesn't aggro the dogs as much. We can get around the dogs. Just don't want to deal with the dogs, they're the worst. There might be an alternate. Yeah, you don't have to deal with them. Oh, sir. Oh, you. Yeah. Time to die to a Molotov. Yep, to the face. I thought that guy was gonna point blank hook a Molotov at me. Like, the part- like, the part with the Kanehurst ticks in the DLC- yeah, with the sniper shooting at you. Gotta love dealing with ranged attacks while getting absolutely eviscerated by something. Melee. Can I just run? Or am I gonna get molotovs? Let's find out. <laughs> Alright. Where's the dog at? Hello? I want this thing. It's probably not even worth it, but I want it. I saw this guy! I was like out of the corner of my eye to see this guy. Oh, I gotta go that way. I gotta go that way. Alright, I'm just not gonna fight these guys. Fuck these guys. <laughs> uh, the answer is no. Panda, how do you have all these quotes? You got them. Get them like indexed them. Oh. This area in general, like, this is the worst area of the game for me. So, this is just particularly difficult to get through, even at like regular levels. So you're struggling. You made it upstairs, congratulations. Time to get comfy. Yeah, the shortcut. My brain, as soon as I saw that, my brain was like, hmm. Alright. Hell 
help me! Go, go! They're like, help me, but then, then they chase me. <laughs> it's not a good incentive to help them if they're chasing, trying to kill. What's happening? Dark Holder! Ah! Thank you so much for the sub. How you doing? Thank you so much for all the support. Help! Oh no! Oh, I guess I'll die. Run, forest, run. Oh, don't worry, we running. That's all we can do. I love the forest, it's very spooky. Dark Holder, did you ever try BL4? I don't know if I would recommend it. <laughs> oh. This area is such a maze. Okay. I think we juked the guy with the pitchfork. Nope. Okay, we kinda did. I'm just trying to get around the dogs. So we just went up here to the right, though. I just aggroed one of them. They're fine if they're one at a time. It's when they're all grouped. Is there one in here, too? This is so suspicious. Ooh! Ah! You, you don't do challenge runs? No, it's, it's... Don't blame you. This is, like, way more stress than I was anticipating. It does feel like a first playthrough, though. Like, if you're, if you're trying to relive the struggle of a first playthrough and being absolutely petrified of everything everywhere, it's pretty good for that. So this will pretend, prevent the dogs from following me, but then I can't go this way. Hmm. Whenever you say Beal, it doesn't mean... Well, a little does it mean boys love? That's gay. Oh, well, I'm gay. I'm okay. You're having a week. You're gonna be lurking. Oh, you're gonna, you're gonna be playing some Fortnite? Enjoy, Dark Holder. Enjoy the de stress and it do be gay. And that's great. Good boss. Whoa. Okay. What? Hello? <laughs> Alrighty, um, we're just gonna... Okay, apparently he had my echoes, but then he just died, so... Oh man, where the fuck did I see that cave? Where am I? I made a mistake. Man, I cannot see anything. You finally got the main PC back up and running. Oh, oh, you've been playing on controller. Oh, that's fun. Good luck. Yeah, it's, it's a little awkward at first for sure, but it'll definitely be. Probably have an easier time once you get used to it again. I can't imagine playing shooters without... I mean, I play Splatoon without keyboard and mouse, but most shooters are pretty rough without them if you don't have the, the gyro. Okay, Um, this is awkward. Can I get up there? Ooh, this, this motherfucker shoots from all the way over here. You can't get up there. Oh no, he's hauling up here! I don't like the look of that. Can he come up here? No. Going from controller and PS5 60 FPS to keyboard and mouse. Ooh, and 140 FPS. Yo, dang. It's gonna be like some some uh, montage where it gets to get real good because of the extra FPS and the keyboard and mouse. I don't know how skill intensive Fortnite is. I'm assuming it's it's got some skill based stuff to it. Oh, it's through there. How do we get in there? Hold on. Recalculating. <laughs> Blessed shortcut. 
they knew this was a rough area and a big area because they give you two shortcuts. They knew you're gonna be dying quite a bit. Okay. Now, I don't remember where this is in the village, but <laughs> it is a shortcut. I'm, gonna, I'm scared to poke my head out and try to recalibrate where this is. Okay, it's like behind the mob. I'll try to remember for when I die. Past the werewolf. Bloodborne directions. Past the werewolf, behind the writhing snake mass, next to the pile of dead bodies, and uh, through the, the blaze of uh, corpses. You're in bed with the controller, but once you de-rush, you should do a, be a lot better Oh yeah, for sure, on PC. I, wonder, I doubt many people would play better on uh, controller than on keyboard and mouse. It's just, it, it offers so much more precision. The gyro is nice though on the Switch. I don't I'm assuming the other consoles probably have some sort of gyro aim. For FPS. Oh my fucking god! Hello? <laughs> this will give me a good uh, chance to figure out the shortcut. If I die to him. <laughs> have aim assist, Splatoon doesn't. I can tell because I can't aim still. <laughs> wow, there's a ton of twin bloodstone shards here. It's kind of comfy sometimes, like certain games, um, I guess Monster Hunter is not an FPS, but it, it does have weapons that are shooting weapons. Um, it's kind of comfy playing those with controller more than keyboard and mouse. Like I, when I messed around with light bow gun in Monster Hunter, I used the, uh, Oh god, this part. Um, controller. This is this is uh, yep. Um. Oh my god, I'm gonna die here, hundred percent. Deep Rock plays okay controller, really. I bought that on. I got the. No, I got that gifted on sale. But um, or I, I, someone gifted it to me, and I convinced someone to buy it on sale. <laughs> Words. Um, but still haven't got around to play it yet. There's a guy in here. Okay. Well, oh, there's a guy over there. Was he just standing there behind me? What's all this? This is junk. Oh, it's just another path through. Where am I? <laughs> it's a lot of fun with a group. Yeah, it seems like the type of game that's yeah, it's pretty much made to be with a group. I don't know uh, if it's any fun solo. Is it so warm in here? I got that window wide open. Dino sweater too warm. I want to kill this guy. It's making me nervous. Him between him and the cannon. Okay. Um. So here's the thing. I think I run over there, but I don't remember. So this may result in an untimely death. Let's go. Someone died. <laughs> you haven't played any Dark Souls games yet? Hopefully one day? The, uh, they're all pretty much worth playing. I mean, I didn't play two, but I didn't mean to do that. Um, whatchamacallit? Uh, hey, Guy Guy! How you doing? Thank you so much for the sub! So thank you, thank you for the seven months of support. I hope you've been doing well, Guy Guy. Exoprimal is available? Oh. I don't know if I'm gonna play it. <laughs> I'm wondering, I'm like, now I'm into this. This is what, why I said it was like, I don't know if I'm gonna play it. It's available till Sunday, right? Cause I, I am free pretty much like tomorrow, all day. I have tomorrow off cause I have an appointment for my eyeball. America. This is a letter. Thank you for the Thank you, thank you. How's your 
stream? If you're not getting bombarded with ads, how was your stream and what were you playing tonight? Thank you so much for the raid. We're doing uh, doing a little Bloodborne challenge run poorly at the moment. What is find love or die trying? What is that? Explain. Yeah, I hope you had a good stream. Welcome on in, guys. Um. Well, we sure do have a lot of shards. This is so scary. I have never been this terrified playing this game because it feels like if a werewolf sneezes on you, you just die. Like this, this has turned the game into a survival horror game. More than, more than an action game. And this is where the guys with the snake heads are. Oh man, I'm so close to the shortcut I can taste it, but I can't remember where it is. Don't tell me. Don't tell me, I'll figure it out. Um, but we're, we're like, there's an elevator. I think it's down there. I think this is where the abhorrent beast is. Not here, so. Is it down there? It's so spooky out here. You missed the beginning. Is this new DLC for the game? I thought you finished it a while ago. I did. The last time I played it was four years ago. I'm doing a ch challenged run. Challenged run. My, the challenge part being my brain. Um. I purposely avoided playing it for a few years to see what it would be like de-rusting. Um, and then someone convinced me to not level my character at all. So we're seeing how far I can get without leveling, which is effectively a challenge run. Because I have base vitality and everything one or two shots. At this point in the game. It's over there. It's over there. It's over there. Oh no, that's the other one. Oh fuck, that's the other one. It's not this one. There's two shortcuts. That's the later one. <laughs> I'll die. Okay, brain. Brain GPS. <laughs> brain GPS. Is it here? Yes, it's here. It's here. <laughs> it was entirely muscle memory, remembering where this is. Because I cannot navigate this area for shit. I have altered. You streamed for 11 hours? Wow, that is a long stream. You restarted Fun Love or Die trying a visual mystery novel. And you did four episodes of Vox Machina Watch Through Party. Oh, that sounds nice. Sounds like you had an eventful day, Scarlet. And you had a good stream. Ah, a new face, are you? And an accomplished hunter, mm. it would appear. How can you see that? You don't have eye holes, do you? He has like one eye hole. I am Volta, master of the League. Members of the League cleanse the streets of all the filth that spread about during the hunt. Like any half-decent hunter ought to, you know? Haven't you seen enough of these wretched beasts, freakish slugs and mad doctors? Sentence these fiends to death with the help of your League confederates. I feel like this guy's the what only sane guy here. Why not join it's like, just the burn it all, kill them all. Shit's too messed up to fix, just murder everything. Yes. As a hunter, well should. How's it going? Ark's welcome. Great start. Thank you for the follow. Our oh, own Captain. Carol Rune, symbol of the League. Impurity. The night brims with defiled I love scum his voice actually. and is permeated by their rotten stench. Just think, now you're all set to hunt and kill to your heart's content. Hunt in cooperation with your fellows, your League confederates. <laughs> yeah. 
you're heading out. Thanks for, for hanging out, and I hope you have a good night. I'll catch you well, later. There is one thing you must know. By the oath of the like, thank you, we need those it. Those <laughs> who bear its rune will see vermin. Vermin. Oh, I forgot about the vermin. Deep within all filth and are the root of man's impurity. I all that whole vermin, vermin stuff. Are to be crushed. The league exists to expunge all vermin, ridding us of any trace of human corruption. And so, until we are rid of all vermin, you must continue to hunt and kill. This bloody fate is ours alone. Do not expect the world to grasp our work. But remember, We're so misunderstood. The Confederates will always have my blessing and each other. Always. The League is. And so. Okay, this okay, bloody okay. fate. Yep. Not... It's a broken record. <laughs> that. This shortcut. One of the best feeling shortcuts in the game. So let all of the shortcuts in this area just to cut it down. Because it is a nightmare getting through this area. I know I missed a ton of treasures and stuff too. Sleep is coming to you because you've been technically up since 126. Oh dang, get some sleep, Scarlet. Sleep is important. Especially after 11 hours streaming. Doesn't seem like people think streaming's easy, but it really takes a lot out of you, especially for that long. I don't know how people full time stream. Like how they have the energy to do it. I get sleepy. I had to get up at eight thirty today, and that was enough. Or work thing, work call. Oh, okay. So we got the shortcut. Mission accomplished. There, got some vials. Probably enough to make up for the vials we lost running in a panic through the area. Scarlet sending you love, Charlie. She's sending gentle stories from the country. What's up, Ujanga? How you doing? Happy Thursday. My day's been alright. How about yours? It's kind of... kind of unproductive. Just had a work call and then... kind of... updating myself because they moved me to a new book. What you been up to? It's just like getting used to the new characters in the book and stuff. Hopefully it'll go okay though. With the, uh, reviewing. Okay. Um, so there is another area to like drop down in here. I'm not gonna mess with these mounds. They're very scary. They're very squishy. Ain't about that life. Snake life. Um, how do I get past these mounds? Without the snake. Okay. Alright, I think I might be screwed now. I was gonna try to run up past him. Alright, which way is he gonna go? Tactical espionage action. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. He's stupid. Surprised that visceral did okay bye. <laughs> that visceral did anything. Uh you're doing okay just been recovering from the game and binge. Are you playing more of uh what was it Mad was it Majesty Gold? Is that your new addiction? So it's important to have at least one gaming addiction at any given time. Mine is still Taiku. Like, like, if you don't have one game that you can keep coming back to, it's rough. Leafs! Where 
Where am I? Where actually am I? This is not where I thought it was. <laughs> okay. Poison knives? Okay. Cool. Perfect. Uh, this way. Is this where Morgan Beast is? Yes. And then you cheese him through the door. I remember. That's why they give you the poison knives. I remember. Majesty Gold and Random Games of the Princess. Wait, what's the Princess Guide? Did I finish that this month? What is that? You can just kind of leave him here, right? And it won't do anything? You know, they give you the poison knives, and I don't think I ever actually use them against him. <laughs> but they're clearly, like, they clearly put them there. They set up the cheese. A knife slathered in poison. This curved knife is as thin and sharp as a surgeon's blade, often used for self-defense by special doctors and the healing church. They say that hunters traditionally avoid the use of poison, likely because the poison is too slow to act in the heat of the hunt. Like, they- they set this shit up so plain. <laughs> Looking at it now. We'll try it. Whoa! Blimey. Don't scare me like that. On a night like this, I took you for a monster. Oh, thank the stars. You're fairly normal. Was it you who put down that awful beast? Ooh, that thing had me trembling. Which one? In me boots. And then you came along. Well, if you're a hunter, then would you know of any safe havens? Oh, yeah, of course not. I should have known. This whole place is falling apart once again. It's the curse of Yarnum. He's totally normal. Oh, you, you find any night? So here's the thing. Every Soulsborne game seems to have the one guy that if you tell him where the safe place is, he just murders everyone you love and care about. Uh, that's this guy. So we're not gonna tell him. <laughs> it's an action RPG and raising simulator. You're teaching four princesses how to get stronger and lead their units? What? Action RPG and raising? I've never heard of that. Heal. You ended up killing him? Yeah. Yeah, you don't, you don't, I don't think you get anything good out of letting him kill everyone. Oh yeah, of course not. This whole place is full. It's the curse. But. I'm not sure. Oh, shit, I didn't do the visceral. Hello? Oh, you find any nice... Cozy places to hole up in. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Even oh, yeah, after that, this whole place is—it's the curse of. Even after that, he's just like fine with you. You really have to aggro him. It's hard to freaking target the backs of the locked one. Have you got a screw loose, or is it your? Time to die. You. Time to die. <laughs> he still reaches. Is it enough to kill him? No, you just have to hit him. <laughs> you like some gameplay on it? Yeah, sounds good, Bajongo. Now we wait. I love fighting this guy. This is a really fun mini boss to fight in the Chalice Dungeons. But the platform out here, you just fall off and die, unfortunately. It's too, the zone of space. 
I don't think I get anything for killing him. Unfortunately, I used knives because I didn't realize they don't they, they don't stack poison. It's one just one knife will poison him. Oh, this is specifically set up, cheese. It's so funny how clear it is. I don't know. I, I think I have enough poison knives. I would love to fight him legit, but it's too scary. <laughs> Die. Die. He's too killers stupid! Killers, the <laughs> you call me a beast? He's too big. A beast? What would you know? Oh, I didn't ask for this. I know this is very exciting, guys. <laughs> this is like Elden Ring gameplay where everyone just rots the boss until it dies and hides in a corner. His rot is so busted. Oh, this is great. He's so cool looking. I love his design. <laughs> I went to sarcastically clap and he somehow managed to reach me. Oh, wait, there's no fucking way I'm fighting this guy in derp on that tiny, that tiny uh, platform. No way. I'm beating him in the chalice dungeons, so that's enough for me. Beast, beasts all over the shop. Beast rune. I don't even think this is any good, but we have it. Secret symbol left by Carol Runesmith of Bergenworth. A transcription of the roar of a labyrinth beast. The bearer of the beast rune has accentuated temporary transformation attacks. Beast is one of the early Carol runes, as well as one of the first to be deemed forbidden. The discovery of blood entailed the discovery of undesirable beasts. So, again, I've been list. I listened to ten minutes of Bloodborne lore today, guys. I'm trying to actually figure out what the heck's going on in this game. Um, so there were a group of scholars in Bergenworth, which is a location in the game, that were studying, you know, scholarly things. Um, and they stumbled across the underground ruins, I guess, and that's where they found the old blood. And brought it to the surface, and it corrupted everything. That is my understanding. Um, but there was some sort of schism between different people in the group of scholars. And some of them were after the pursuit of power, I guess, and some were after the pursuit of knowledge. And I think that's what the the differentiation is with, like, the beast runes and stuff, like it said on the, on the beast rune, uh... It was forbidden because they don't want people using it. There's certain branches of, of the, the scholars, I guess, that were against embracing the inner beast. Going the path of the beast. Becoming beast. <laughs> Did you see the big the swole furry? Did you see the swole furry that I cheesed? Embrace inner beast, become wolf of war. Oh! Cannon. It's cannon. Large prototype firearms fashioned by the workshop heretics, the powder kegs. Use of this weapon is equivalent to toting a mounted cannon, complete with its ridiculous weight, staggering kick, and lavish use of quick sil silver bullets <laughs> into battle. Such a monstrosity was doomed from the start, and indeed its development was cut short. Yet, against impossibly gigantic foes, it might just be the thing. I've never used this, but it seems very funny. Alright, I am going to die, so I'm just gonna go buy Blood Vial. Eh, do I go buy Blood Vial? Eh, it's only 8 though. Ah, eh, if I die, it's fine. This is the, the BL4 <laughs> logic. It's like, I can go home and buy like 10 Blood Vials, 12 Blood Vials, or I can just, you know, if I die, I die, it's fine. Can I jump down there? I want to get that 
thing that he's guarding, but it's probably not worth it. Whatever it is. Yeah! <laughs> uh, nope, that wasn't worth it. Noted. This is very spooky! <laughs> snake people. Okay, we've reached the snake portion of the of the game. My favorite map. There, there's a meme that someone drew a map of the Forbidden Woods and it's just a circle that says snakes in it. It's a circle with an opening that says snakes. It's my favorite Bloodborne meme. It's what you get! It is. We asked for that. We also got Madman's knowledge. And the knowledge that we got from that was it wasn't worth it. What's down here? Death. Okay. Thought so. Okay. It's time for snake. I love too that the this part of the game like this map in particular is serpentine and the enemies are just snakes. It's perfect. This is a this is a beautiful game. Plus seven cleaver doing some work here. Oh, they give you the shining coin so you don't get lost. But I still get lost. They do be snaking. I feel like it's just infinity snakes, like they don't stop. I don't know if there's like a snake spawner or if it just seems like there's a billion snakes. But there's a lot of there's a lot of snakes here. And then there's some piles of like extra big snakes. Just to make things more exciting. Someone is breathing extra heavy. I don't know if it's a snake or a man or a snake man, but they're up on the right here. I can hear. What the fuck is that? <laughs> just, just one stare. <laughs> What actually is that? You hear that, right? <laughs> That's an awfully big tombstone. I wonder what, like, I, I understand it's the gothic art style of the game, but I never thought for, like, war lore reasons why there's just tombstones everywhere. Just a billion tombstones. Yo, they're definitely, like, Infinitely respawning snakes. Many snake. Man, I sure could use some blood vials. Can I get up there? I want to see who, who breathing heavy. I see them up there. I think you can get up there. There's something hanging up there. I think I missed a path to get up there. There was an item. I just don't want to miss- I think there is the stamina rune in this area. Somewhere. It's like a gated area, I think, with a rune. 
How's it going? Uh, is it Sink or, or Kink? <laughs> How you doing? You just finished the Shadows of Yarnum. You hate the Forbidden Woods. Is it your first playthrough? This area is a fucking nightmare. So I, I feel you on that one. There's so many fucking snakes. I still can't tell. Th thank you, thank you, Toodles. Thank you. Thank you. You just gonna say that to anyone who comes in? Toodles is flexing for me. On my behalf, because I refuse to flex. So the back of these are covered in uh, little sluggos. Vicar yeah, like the <laughs> vicarious flex. These are little sluggos. Those are like great one babies, aren't they? It's your third playthrough, but you always get lost. You know, same this area. As I was just saying, there's a map meme of this area that just says Forbidden Woods and it's just a circle and it just says snakes in it. That's the map. <laughs> Cause it's just like, good luck trying to navigate it every every time I don't know how people get through it they give you the shining coins like they're trying to tell you just drop the coins so you know where you've been already oh no <laughs> but uh it doesn't help too much so that's the big snake I was wondering when he would come out to play um can we just drop him or am I gonna die it's not too high up. Oh, this is not good. <laughs> uh oh, I'm in Wub Wub Town. I forgot about Wub Wub Town. <laughs> this is where we die because they all do big old laser beam attacks. Time to dead. Yeah! <laughs> Help! There's stuff up there, but I can't. I think this is also close to the second shortcut. Oh, this is nice and peaceful here. That's a big pig. That do be a big pig. I hear him pigging down there. Yeah, at the beginning. That's what I was looking for. Do you know what rune it was? Is it worth getting? I forget what rune it was, but I remembered there was like something down there. The con you're going to is getting almost the whole main cast of Du Bois. Uh, are you going to have time to meet them? What is that? The pig? The first time you're in the Forbidden Woods, you're playing with your headphones, making it worse. Yeah. Always got to play Bloodborne with headphones. Sound design's too good not to. I think. In my, in my humble opinion. Now... That's just the alien area. All right, don't tell me where the shortcut is, guys. But it's around here, right? I just want a yes or no. I want to try to find it. I think it's around here, but it's always a bitch to find from here. I think I'm like very close to it. Oh, it is the stamina one. Yeah, that's absolutely worth it. Okay. Yeah, the stamina ones you want for BL4. Okay, I got to go back there, but I'm going to pop the shortcut first. There's a couple of shortcuts. Is it up here? It's not all the way. No. Yeah, no, no telling. I'm, I'm thinking. I think it's around here. But I went the wrong way. <laughs> I went the wrong way. Oh no. Oh oh no. Okay. All right. 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 I think I'm running backwards. It's fine. We got plenty of fun and exciting stuff to explore. 
Hold up. Am I in Alienville again? I'm in Alienville again. <laughs> I'm gonna die in Alienville anyway. Ow, sir. Even if I die here, I just wanted to get that. That's fine. That's all I wanted to get. actually go equip that right now because I could really use the extra stamina <laughs> if that's the stamina one it's behind the third hill those things bolting out of the ground look like giant peanuts oh I think they're supposed to be amygdala heads it costs money to meet them what the heck you pay money to go into the calm and then it costs money to meet them that's not fair. What's up, Wolf Blake? You recently downloaded Bloodborne and you're hitting the whip. With the Beast Claws. The Beast Claws you gotta get in the dungeon, right? I did a Beast Claws playthrough a long time ago. They're pretty fun. Are you using the, uh, the Beast Rune, too? The other one that transforms you into a beast? Ow, ow, okay, okay, guess I'll die. Guess I'll, guess I'll die. How's it going? <laughs> Approxis. <laughs> How's it going? It's, it's going going great here. I just died to a fucking crow. <laughs> I'm going back. I gotta equip uh anti-clockwise metamorphosis. <laughs> yeah, that's perfect. Those guys, I swear the crows are deceptively dangerous, because if you get hit once you just get kinda chain stunned and die. Them and the dogs have died to probably more times than some of the bosses. Bloodborne sadly makes you take more damage, uh-huh, but deal more damage to you. Yeah, definitely encourages you to be extremely aggressive, which is, uh, what I enjoy about it, but... <laughs> crow sip! That's what the crow doing after they murder you. Just in in sipping your tears. Alright. Um, so we're gonna equip these anti-clockwise, I think is the one. If it is the stamina one, please god, give me stamina. Yes. Secret symbol left by Carol, runesmith of Bergenworth. A twisted cross means metamorphosis. Rotated anti-clockwise. This rune boosts stamina. The discovery of blood made their dream of evolution a reality. Metamorphosis and the excesses and deviation that followed is only the beginning. You want to be full strength stamina and HP build? That's very fun. So you're doing uh, Beast Claws, are you using a secondary weapon? So the plan for this run, guys, when I started off, uh, there's a few new people here who don't know the backstory, so basically I played a shit ton of Bloodborne between 2017 and 2018. I played probably like 500 hours. I got the platinum. I did all the chalices and all that stuff. Um, then did not play it, did not watch it, did not do anything involving Bloodborne for four years. Until now, and now we're back, and I was just gonna do a casual de-rusting run with the amygdala arm, which I've never used, but someone talked me into trying BL4, um, so that we're gonna see how far we can get with BL4. I don't think I'm gonna do a full, full BL4, because I'm not good at the game, but I'm gonna damn well try to get far with it, so we'll see. Um, I mean, it doesn't hurt to equip all these, right? I guess we'll do Blood Bell Maximum. Is, it, is there any reason to do this? There's no reason not to do that. <laughs> oh, that blessed 10% stamina. Let's go. Let's go. Robots versus dinos is kind of neat. You mean it's dumb, but it's kind of neat. Oh, did you try it already, Risu? Does it make you go through like a tutorial? I was waiting to see if Age wanted to play. Otherwise, I'm probably just gonna keep plunking away at this. Until we can, unless we can get like a few people. I'm gonna have to pee. There is a tutorial. Bleh. Maybe I'll like do tutorial and maybe do it on Sunday or something. It makes you do it! Gross! <sighs> ah. 
Ah, excuse me. Gross. Good to know, though. I was fully expecting it to be, like, stupid fun. But at least it's it's fun. From the sounds of it. A little bit you played. A lantern. Almost forgot. Alright, we got extra stamina. We're gonna be flying now. just threw myself <laughs> into the abyss. <laughs> you appreciate games that don't take themselves too seriously? We haven't had fun for the sake of fun in a AAA, yeah, in a long time. That's very true. And people were, like, if, uh, we're, we're talking about Exoprimal, um, because the open beta is today, and I, I might check it out, but the reviews of it, people were like, this looks like a PS3 game, this game looks like it came out in tw like 2005, and that's not necessarily a bad thing. Like, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why people were making that out to be a bad thing, because there were a lot of fun games from that time period. But, yeah, I guess people don't have a sense of humor. That's why I like the Yakuza game so much, they're just total clown town. Oh, there's a guy. Ah! There's a guy! <laughs> What's up, Winter? Ah! He jumps! Okay, guess I'll die. <laughs> oh, it was being sneaky. Bloodburn's <laughs> uh, one of the few games that takes long enough for you to, uh, to load, to read the, uh, loading tips. My rust is showing, of course. I'm also still BL4, so it's like extra rust. Be crying on BL7 with your skill button character. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah, they say it's a bad thing. Oh, you triggered, you triggered, you like did a reverso with the bot because you talked about Metal Gear, but you talked about the right Metal Gear. Congratulations. I think that's the first time that's happened. <laughs> So it's a meme because I hate Metal Gear as a franchise, but played Metal Gear Rising and thought it was absolutely incredible. And when you mentioned games that were fun, that was one that came to mind. Because it's just, it's so wild. So over the top, soundtrack slaps, it's just hack and slash combat. Doesn't really have too much of a story or anything, it's just fun. Tutorial's like 15 minutes tops, also you get to be a T-Rex. My goodness, that is, is a pretty powerful incentive to play. You just want your Snake Eater remake? They're just sitting on money by not porting this to PC. You hate Metal Gear? What the hell? Hold on. You, have you seen the clip? Click that. <laughs> if you're a Metal Gear fan, click that. <laughs> Oh! Alright, there's a shiny over here that we were trying to get. Oh, don't thank me, thank Age, who paid money for <laughs> David Hayter to say that <laughs> at a convention. Oh, there, there sure do be a lot of snakes down here in, in uh, the Forbidden Woods. Got plenty of twin bloodstone shards though for my BL4 run with one weapon. <laughs> this is great. Nah, he seems great. I got nothing against like the people who worked on Metal Gear. I got nothing like I just don't like stealth, so. Thanks for the follow. Ah! <laughs> Wait, is this stuff down there? Oh, that's the Wubby Land. Okay, I keep going to Wub Land, but I'm not trying to go to Wub Land. Brain. Neuron. I'm, I'm in. I'm in Wubland. I didn't want to go to Wubland. What's, what's the What's the way out of Wubland? <laughs> oh no! What's up? 
Sailor, Sailor Moan. <laughs> nice name. <laughs> Regurgit, chew ass and kick gum. And you're all out of feet. Are you okay? Is everything is, is everything all right? I think it, you, you, got, you got a little scrambled there. Something got a little scrambled. <laughs> you forgot how long the loading screens are. Yeah, you, you remember very quickly doing BL4 run as a bad player uh, how bad the loading screens are because you die a lot. But yeah, coming from uh, from Elden Ring, which was on PC, was pretty much instant. It's uh. It's rough. You're witty, hit it, witty. Right now. Are we, are we Elmer Fudman? Oh. oh, it's a snake. Oh, a snake. That's the way I came from. What was that attack? Just like. The wiggle arm. Is it faster on PS5? I don't have a PS5. I'm playing on the, the PS4 Slim. Classic. You start a new character to rush getting beast claws. And run the whole game with them if you can. The only way to get them is the chalices there, right? How deep are they in the chalices? You still yet to play Elden Ring. You've been playing Sekiro. How are you liking Sekiro? It's very different from the other ones. Combat's pretty good though. Elden Ring is uh, kind of a mixed bag. I'm a Bloodborne fangirl, so I'm partial, but I didn't like the combat in Elden Ring at all. I thought the the enemies were too fast and the player was too slow. It felt like playing against Bloodborne enemies um, with a Dark Souls character. Okay. Okay, I'm, gl I'm really glad we retrieved our zero blood echoes. Oh, you have the code! Oh, nice. Do you have the code for the cum dungeon? I learned about the cum dungeon recently. I've been out of the Bloodborne loop. And then I went to the Bloodborne Reddit, and the first post I saw was Is it cheating to use the cum dungeon? I'm like, what in God's name is the cum dungeon? Stop saying cum dungeon? Should you want me to stop saying cum dungeon? I'm sorry if Cum Dungeon makes you uncomfortable. Is this the light of game? Oh no, that's the that's the lake. Okay, we got a big we got a big ball of snakes. The Cum Dungeon toodles. You don't know about the Cum Dungeon? I thought of all people you would know about the Cum Dungeon. I'm getting flanked. <laughs> it's a it's a dungeon. It's a hacked dungeon. With the code C U M M something or other, so people <laughs> people call it the Cum Dungeon because they get infinite currency by spawning into it without doing anything. Oh, I, d I downloaded the right Bloodborne. I learned this from Reddit, so it has to be true. It has to be true. I think it's hacked. He do be gurgling. Making my way downtown. I just went. I was just here, I think. <laughs> no, no, no. It's it's not like that at all. Sorry to disappoint. Was there something around here with the the? Oh yeah, there is. Big cold blood for me. And another one. Clear deep sea. Oh, if we didn't come up here, we wouldn't have the clear deep sea. Can I go down here? That looks like death, but the other way is death too. So. <laughs> Too busy avoiding the snakes to see Twitch chat. <laughs> Getting all in a tizzy over the cum dungeon. We're, we're all adults here. If you're not an adult, you shouldn't be here. You should you should uh, go back to school. Go to go to biology class. Wee! Ow! 
Don't spit on me, please. Please don't spit on me. I need to get to a safe place to read Twitch chat, but joke's on me. There's no safe place. It's all death. This town's finished. It's all my fault. Oh, well. Oh. What's up here? I hear a pig. I hear a piggy wig. Oh, that's that sure do be a big snake. Should I like just record this and, and upload uh, three hours Forbidden Wood Snake ASMR to YouTube for the ad money? This is safe, right? You do have it saved in one of your seven chalice slots? Oh, you don't have PS Plus? Yeah, I don't have it either. Hi, Potato! You heard Calm Dungeon and Red Hair as quick as you could. Yeah, you got her just in time. How you doing, Potato? And also for snakes. Huh. Okay, that's the Wub Wub land. Wait, so... There's so many snakes. Is that okay, I'm out. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> We're eating salmon and veggie roasted. Oh, nice. Did you bring enough to share with the torch trap? I want to get up there. Oh, I hear a pig. I think that's like the executioner clothes that are really ugly up there. Mm. Ah, echoes. Mm. Avert your eyes. Anyone sensitive in the audience, avert your eyes. Y'all can fucking serve. Thanks, potato. Appreciate you. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, we're eating. Get to get plenty of snake to go around. I'm sure, people eat snake, right? How bad could it be? It probably tastes like chicken. Ooh, ugly. I hear hissing. I want to read the lore, but I hear like gentle hissing in the background. Did you? Yeah, you missed pig butt. How did you know? I missed the pig butt. You've had rattlesnake. It's probably really bony, right? Because their whole body is like a spinal column. I'd imagine it being pretty bony. Like little fish bone type things. I think. 30% of my playtime in Bloodborne is usually in this area, just because I have no idea what's happening and where I am. And it's just so dark and everything looks the same, and my brain is just like, Ooh. Well, thank you. Well, actually, maybe decided to work. Here. I knew it was here. My spidey senses were tingling the whole time. Fucking knew it. <laughs> I just couldn't triangulate the exact location. We did it. So this run's fun because like I'm trying to find the shortcuts and stuff, but it's also kind of feeling like I'm gaslighting myself at the same time. Because I remember where they are, but I don't remember at the same time. It's great. They deboned it. It's little rattlesnake nuggets? Rattlesnake nuggies? Exotic meats. Oh, they're Brazilian. Like, rattlesnake barbecue? Nuggets? Brazilian barbecue's so fucking good. 
Like, never would have thought I would have eaten chicken hearts in my lifetime until Brazilian barbecue just made them absolutely delicious. We'll eat all of the chicken hearts. Boar. Does boar taste like just ham? Or is it gamey? Okay, so now we unlock the shortcut. Now we just gotta remember what to do with it. Chicken hearts and gizzards. What actually are gizzards? Shrimpy doodle. What's up, Shoko? How you doing? What's up? What's up? What's up? Fucking love those hearts. Why are the hearts so good? They're so good. Wasn't gamey. It's pretty rich. Mm. And boars are like pest animals in a lot of places, so that's that's a good thing to be to be eating them. Oh, guess I'll die. Big pig. Yep. Guess I'll die. <laughs> Oh, I'm de-rusted. I'm BL4, Shoko. Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> you should just run. Birds don't have beaks, so they eat rocks. And the gizzard grounds up the food in the stomach. Oh, they don't have teeth. Um, so it's just another organ? But like, where is it? It's in their stomach? It's by their stomach? Accidental BL BL4 yeah, dork, uh, not dork. Derp peer pressured me. <laughs> Derp peer pressured me to not level. I'm just seeing how far I can get. You did BL4, didn't you, Shoko? Did you? Am I misremembering? It's a muscle. Oh. You did orphan kicked your ass for days. He was the hardest for you. I'm scared. I'm scared. I haven't looked up like any BL4 strategies or anything, which is probably a bad idea. Um. Okay, so we we did that, and then we run in here to the other elevator. A lot of people have been saying that Lawrence is the worst one. I'm not even thinking about the DLC right now, to be honest. <laughs> just trying to get, like, I think this is gonna be a wall. The Shadows of Yarnum, because they're just not a fun fight. The, any sort of, like, gank boss in general is usually agony. But 3v1 is just unfair at BL4. Okay. Well, we figured out the shortcut. Let me just do a little icky loop around uh, to the pig. Sprint through here. Very timing. No, oh, a little too slow. It's so awkward, this one. <laughs> Delayed attacks, it's like Elden Ring shit. You're not good enough for it. Big pig. to the heart since they're both muscles that are also special organs. Well, they have the same texture. I don't know. So it's probably equally delicious. Hearts have, like, probably some nutrients in it too that the other muscle meats don't. 
That always kind of bothered me that we waste organ meats in the West. A lot of, uh, a lot of organ meats go to waste, at least in the U.S. When those are... That's the good shit, that's the nutritious stuff. This is bad. Is this worth it? Probably not. Dissipating lake. You don't waste the meat because you don't eat any meat. You don't eat any meat. How can you have any pudding if you don't eat your meat? Oh, yes, I'll buy. I forgot they burp. The stank. I like the way they laugh at you, though. <laughs> I guess I'll die. Guess I'll die. Guess I'll die. Going in circles. Well, he's cooking himself. Ah! Who's coming? Okay, yeah. <laughs> it's like the last second you uh, carry it. These guys are the worst. Man, if I don't bust style them, I just get my shit kicked in. You forgot what the strategy for the third beast was. Hit him in the legs. What's the beach? Just buy pudding. How can you buy any pudding if you don't eat your meat? Is did you want to play Dido King? Okay? Wish I could play Bloodboard. <sighs> oh. I'm almost at Shadows of Yarnum, which is gonna be agony. I should probably back up my safe. Cause we are gonna go for some vials. Sure, we're gonna be going for some vials. You gotta, yeah, you gotta download and you're gonna make a Capcom account, which is what I was like, I don't know if you're gonna do that. <laughs> we still downloaded it. We said it's all right, but. Yeah. Exoprimal beta. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where am I going? No, I just like autopilot brain. Okay, I went down the elevator. I'm gonna go over here. I already had a Capcom account though. I don't know what you do if you don't have one. Let's play dinosaur and don't know, it's not the same. Character looks so cool. No one even knows I'm a juggalo anymore. They don't even know I'm a juggalo. Probably go above and then drop down, or just run like a bitch. I got a bunch of runes. I don't think any of them are particularly useful for this playthrough. Oh, you do be stampeding back there. Did you stakes? <laughs> Did I snakes? Do you think I snakes? <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> I was sprinting, so I didn't think he was gonna track that. <laughs> I didn't think he was gonna track it. <laughs> <laughs> ah, there's another shortcut too. Another one. I get hello door. I have an appointment tomorrow to get my eyelid checked out, and the thing on my eyelid's almost gone. 
So I'm gonna go there and he's gonna be like, okay. And then I'm just gonna leave. Did they make a Mr. Beast gluten free ball? What? A what? Bol Boyga? A oh, Boyga. There's Mr. Beast Boygas? My brain read that as Bologna? And <laughs> I don't know. You need to be Bloodstar Beast? You do. You do. That's very exciting. Just go to the left. That's all you gotta do. You gotta do to the left, to the left, then you die. Getting there is not the fun part. If I had PS Plus, you could summon me, but I don't. You could summon me and I could die. Because <laughs> I'm the same level. <laughs> it's so funny when, like, people you summon people into BL4 runs. They just have no HP. What's up, Bobo? What are you doing? Oh no. I just want to read the tooltips on the load screens. Oh, you started with Violent Pazia, yeah, you probably are a slightly higher level. Not by much, though. That's the skill one, right? For the skill stats. Oh my god! Oh my god, thank you for the follow. This is the content people want to see, is someone doing a charge attack in an elevator and then dying like an idiot. Let's go. Love the Forbidden Woods. Love elevators. Pinnacle of technology. Excellent invention. Strength- oh, sorry. Strength and Nerds and Vitality. I was confused. Is that the one that gives extra vitality? I think if it's the extra vitality one, that's the one I usually start with when I don't want to hate myself. Um, so. Waste of skin! Waste of- yeah, that ain't me. Waste of skin. Oh, extra strength. Okay. Vitality is very nice in this game. Very comfy. Vitality, really good stat. Definitely missing. The vitality. How much vitality do I even have? Like, nine? I got ten vitality, that's all you need. Oh, Lone Survivor, that's the one I usually start as. It honestly makes things- it feels like it makes things significantly easier at the start. Not getting clobbered by everything as easily. Oh, excuse me. Alrighty. Well. Find ourselves here again. For the one of a Dark Souls 3 night. I have not played Dark Souls 3 in an even longer time than I've played Bloodborne, so that doesn't really mean much to me. <laughs> or I didn't really play it as much either. Okay, we're just gonna run. I don't know what these guys are guarding. I don't know if it's worth it. I kind of wanted to- maybe I just kill- maybe I just try to kill Big so I can explore, get the items. Dodge. Did I aggro the other one? Yep. No? No, it's just one particularly loud pig. sound. You need to be Gascoigne. <laughs> yeah, it's really hard to start, uh, start a new game without one of, like, just a couple of the weapons. Like, it, all the one, the only ones that are really available to you really are what, like, the Saw Spear and the Three Starters? The others seem like they need some 
finagling to get him. At least it's not a DLC weapon. Those are fun to get. I'm gonna get charged again. Oh, it's all for that. Amygdalan arm was not a fun time to get that. I do have it. I don't have the stats to wield it, but I do have the arm. Proof that we sprinted through the bullshit. I guess you can't see that because my camera's in the way, but it's the arm. So you just gotta take more for it. Pork butt, yeah. Delicious pork butt. Ooh, a summon? I don't know where this gate actually leads to is the problem. But we got we got the thing we need. No, you can drop down here for a shortcut. I'm trying to triangulate how to get here. Oh, is that the one um, that you get from the freaking shark boys in the well? I think everyone has some sort of trauma with that one. Is this a one-shot kill if I plunge attack this snakey? I don't think it isn't. I don't think we're gonna we're gonna try that. I have to pee really bad, but let's just die to the shadows of Yarnum and then uh, move on. I'm gonna die to the shadows of Yarnum. Actually, I'm gonna back up my fucking save file, is what I'm gonna do. Because <laughs> we're gonna chug vials here. So let's do that. Because I am not grinding Yarnum. Sorry. Sorry if that's the content people are looking forward to, but I am backing this shit up. If I remember how. Um. It's not storage, is it? Back it up, do you go from here? Upload, download, upload. They don't let you just do it to a USB from here. Really? Yakuza, yeah, this was my Yakuza and Bloodborne machine for a long time. Places. How did I do that before? I did it and then I forgot how to- Do you guys remember how to back up your safe? I did it last time and I forgot. Did you play like a dragon? No, not yet. I got kind of intimidated with how long the Yakuza games are. There's just so many of them and they're all like 40 hours each. So I just go and play the same game I've played 500 times instead. Um, oh, here. But they're all really good. I don't think there's been one Yakuza game that I've played that's not been fantastic. Okay, we copy in my blood burn. Yes. I like how it went from 20 minutes to 20 seconds. <laughs> Recalculate. <laughs> this is gonna be rough. Like, I never got the hang of the Shadows of Yarnum even on regular playthroughs. Also, aren't they weak to bolt? I don't have any bolt paper. I don't even know if you can get it at this point in the game. This boss just feels lame. Because you just see it walking everywhere later in the game. It's just a regular enemy.
400 hours of fun unless it's Dota 2. This channel says Undertale. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> Just play Megalovania instead of the Shadows of Yarnum music. It's a lot easier. I don't even. What even is the Shadows of Yarnum music? Do they even have a theme? Oh no. Why am I here? Why did it save me here? Out of all the places, why did it- You guys saw where it turned off my PlayStation, right? And it's like, no, you are here. Or turn where I closed uh, Bloodborne was not here. Pretty sure. It was down here. Alrighty then. Time to die. Yeah, there's a thing that does. Oh, I should increase my stamina, actually. Yeah, we're off to a good start. Yeah, they don't even have a theme, they just have a creepy, like, noise. Guess I should heal. <laughs> Sons of bitch. <laughs> I'm gonna go uh, change my. Maybe, maybe I'll change. Ah! Meh. Hmm. Maybe the extra stamina would help. I can get more stamina. Ugh. What is their lore? That's a good question. I don't remember. They're like snake people? Is there lore for them? They're like snake wizards? So... Where was that gate? The, the shortcut. I just don't remember. Does anyone know? The, I unlocked the gate. It's down here, right? But not the second part? You don't want to fight the angry grave digger? Who's that? No! <laughs> I'm gonna have pee, I'll be right back. And I'm gonna feed Charlie. I'm gonna feed Charlie stupid. and pee. You're Goodbye. So
Well, I got a snack. I got. Guess what it is? Guess what it is? It's not yogurt. Really, I got you a snack too. Oh, good, good job. Thank you. You gotta be. <laughs> Beer is a snack. It's made out of, made out of food, made out of wheat. Churro chip. DMCA to strike me so I Thank you so much for the resub ground. Thank you for all of the shrimpies. shrimpies. Appreciate you. Thank you so much, Grim. For the resub. Oh, welcome back to the monsters. I hope you continue to enjoy your shrimpies. Hi bees! How you doing? Um That shortcut, guys, through the gate, do you get to it from here or do you go down the elevator? Almost sub baby time. It is one more month. Hold on, I gotta text my ma'am goodnight. Um, which one? The- so the- the closest shortcut to the Shadows of Yarnum is that gate, right? That you unlock? I think? The one that had the rune next to it and the snake man? <laughs> Not the elevators, but I'm trying to figure out like how- where that is accessible from. Oh, this might be useful against, um, Parl. Ten percent, five percent. HP. Hmm. Go down the elevator and hug the right. You can jump down to some gates. Okay, thank you. It's a pretty- yeah, I remember being kind of a pain. Hug the right. The first elevator resume? What up, T-shirt? How you doing? What up, what up? Nothing's happening, we're just dying to the fucking shadows of Yarno. Yeah, actually, elevators, more realistically. How many elevator deaths was it tonight? It was like three. <laughs> this elevator. And then hug the right. Thank you for trying to give me directions, Reese. <laughs> it's a challenge. Okay. Back to the Bronze Stars t shirt. Enjoy those emos, courtesy of Risu. Enjoy. Enjoy, enjoy. Enjoy the brief break from uh, ads about dead men in Levi's, which I heard is like the hot new ad. Um, I didn't go the right way. <laughs> this may come as a surprise to you guys, but I don't think I went the right way. Just, just have. Oh wait, did I? I did. Oh, it's just a very long run. It's just a stupidly long run. Okay, just don't die. Just get good, and don't die. It's that easy. All right. This <laughs> that boss route is a solid like minute and a half of running. Just don't die. A 
I'm gonna die. <laughs> I don't even remember the strat. I know you're supposed to use this, uh... Oh my god! <laughs> I know you're supposed to use the tombstone to uh, kite them. Well. <laughs> Thanks, H. <laughs> we got this. This is gonna be. It's gonna be fun. I didn't expect to get one shot quite yet. I'm having second thoughts about going back and maybe equipping the plus 5% HP rune, but I don't know if it's enough to prevent the one shots. I think that's just part of the run. Unfortunately. And this isn't even the DLC, this is like the third boss. <laughs> You know I have a gut feeling if by some miracle we get that far is going to be particularly bad is the one reborn because of how flaily he is. Because if you're just playing through that boss on a regular playthrough you just dumb fuck R1 mash and he dies. But you can't do that here! Did I not punk the right enough? I don't think I punked the right enough. Is it even faster to go that way than just run from the second elevator? Good lord, this area. Oh, it is still there. Okay. I don't actually know if this is faster than the other elevator. I guess you don't have to run by the pigs, which is a plus. Um, actually it's the fourth because of the bloodstorm. <laughs> I haven't fought him yet, I skipped that whole area. Because I'm trying to do that thing where you, uh... You, f you see Parl first, and then you go through the back doors so you can friend Jura, so he doesn't shoot at you. <laughs> the boss. <laughs> well, you ran out of beer. Oh, well, you had popsicles, you had your beer. There you go. You're right. Time to die. Okay, I tried to parry. That was a big mistake. Okay, guess I'll die because I'm stuck in a corner. I love these conveniently placed tombstones. Those are those sure are swell. be the worst. it when the thing unlocks. Time to die! 
Okay. 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 Actually get stuck on Father Gats going. No shame. I got stuck on him for a little bit. He's pretty tough at low level. It'd be funnier if they were crab people. Apparently they're lore. Is there some freak Thum Thumerians that oh they got infested with snakes? They're Thumerians? Really? I thought they were all underground. What's up, CDRs? Making good progress? Yeah, it's about to stop, I think, at these guys. <laughs> They're very annoying. This is probably one of my top three least favorite bosses. I think my absolute least favorite is Rom. I don't know, what's everyone's least favorite boss in this game? It's like a toss-up between this Rom and the one reborn. It's just being... Garbo. Like, even the witches, it's a shitty boss, but at least it's easy. They might have been hanging out in the cemetery or something. They're lost. <laughs> oh, yeah, the living failures. Oh, yeah, I forgot about those guys. They're probably rough on BL4, too. Any sort of mob boss is just kind of. It's. It feels like you're fighting the camera on top of everything else. Which is not the most fun experience. Curse Defiled Amy. Oh, yeah, Loran, Dark Beast. I wasn't even thinking of the Chalice ones, but yeah, Loran is way up there. It's sad, too, because it wouldn't be... Wouldn't be... Oh, I went the wrong way. <laughs> it wouldn't be as bad if, if the freaking uh, frame rate could keep up. But it can't. What thing in a corner? I kind of don't want to get that, but. So you can parry these guys, but it seems way scarier than just hacking at them. You love that living failures is followed up immediately by the hardest boss in the game. You find Maria the hardest? Celestial Emissary was probably- yeah, it's just kind of forgettable. Yeah, that's a good one. I, I totally forgot about that one. I'm, I'm more going by like annoyance of fighting them than them just being kind of bleh. I think this is the most annoying. Maria's fun, but I heard for BL4 she's kind of bullshit. Because you can't really just do the typical, like, parry visceral. You're not good with keeping track of the fast ones? Yeah. <laughs> she's very fast. You died so much to Celestial Emissary? What sort of build were you doing? I think they're really weak to thrust, right? I, I just destroyed them with the freaking uh, church pick the run I used that, I remember. Sir. Like, half the trick here is keeping track of the fucking camera. Nice iframes. You <laughs> see that shit? <laughs> Is it BL4 or not BL1? You can't do BL1. This is the lowest starting level. 
All the Souls games are one, but for some reason Bloodborne starts at four. I don't know why they did it that way with the stats. You can parry Maria down to phase three in like 40 seconds with delayed fire. Just, yeah, yeah, the delayed fire apparently is what's the BS part in uh, BO4. Bologna 4. Oh yeah, I went and got the Yarnum outfit before fighting Gascoigne, or uh, before beating him. It definitely helps, having a little extra health, a little uh, defense. Um, what one has a few different starting ones? I think it's got at least seven. There's not a ton of difference between most of them. You glad for the delayed fire? Otherwise you could parry her to death. Yeah, and she would just be kind of big pushover. What's up, BM? How you doing? I think that's one of the problems with the uh, combat. A lot of the bosses can just kind of be parried to death if you're good at parrying. Have we leveled up yet? Nope. <laughs> it was a mistake. Figuring that out at the Shadows of Yorum. <laughs> at the moment. Man, this sure is a shitty boss route. <laughs> they even have Arcane Blood, blood Tinge starting class. I keep- I'm like gonna off myself. Um, for whatever reason- yeah, you can't- right, you can't even use it. <laughs> it's just unviable. Someone does sound kind of angry over there. Yeah, Bloodstar Beast is, is definitely one of the harder ones to parry. I haven't tried with him because it's just easier, it seems like, to weave around him to the left. You can't parry them, but you can, like, break their head. Like, Cleric Beast, you can break his head, right? If you use Molotovs or you shoot it enough. I remember that. When I was really struggling with him, when I was first playing through, I think I used the, the gun to break his head. Just the pistol. To get that opening. I love it when the lock-on just doesn't. Just doesn't. The amount of times too I've died like cornering myself into a tombstone. It is too damn high. That's the only way. Especially when I don't see where the other two are and I don't want to get cornered. Remember, it gets worse than it, than it was before. I think this guy's the worst one because of his like go-go gadget arm.
Like, look at that shit. That's bullshit. I was like mid file, a mile away from him. <laughs> Oh yeah, the music box helps a lot. So I think you can use it twice during his first phase and once during his beast form phase. If you use it three times during his first phase, it makes him hit transform early. So if you use it on him, he goes into an animation. You can do a charge star two behind him to get a visceral while he's doing that. I'm pretty sure. Get by a backseat to Bloodborne Flute. I'm surprised, like, th that's one thing that the games coming out later in these, like, after the internet was established, is kind of not the same as, like, in the Pokemon days where there were the rumors of different items and different Pokemon being in weird places, like. Because people just trusted any dumb shit they read on the internet, but now everyone's so skeptical. Like, there's there's no fun- there's no fun memes like that anymore. About fake stuff in video games. Or like, I remember there was a... April Fools, I think it was EGM did an April Fools that Sonic was gonna be in Smash. And he was eventually, but it was like way before they added him in and it was like, oh my god. There's a hidden <laughs> What? <laughs> snake. Turn to snake. I mean, I guess these guys are just like a different form of the beasts, right? Like instead of turning into furries, they're turning into scalies. But it's still the same. They still got the beast-itis. Some random kids no longer think their friend's uncle works for Nintendo, right? <laughs> it was a rumor and they added it. Oh, that's fun. They actually cared about the rumors. I remember, like, trying so hard to get the Pokemon one to work. Missing No! Yeah, Missing No actually worked, though. That was cool, because as a kid, I was kind of like, oh, there's no way. For some reason, that one I was skeptical on, and then, like, oh my god. It worked. Everyone, yeah, everyone tried to move the dang truck. It doesn't work. Childhood ruined. No free Mew. The only thing that makes this hard is the Go Go Gadget arm guy, so maybe I should take him out first. Before he's in go go gadget arm mode. Like, I know people recommend you take out the mage first because the projectiles, but those don't get me as much as the arm guy. Okay, alright, he took that personally. <laughs> The fun thing 
is if you do by some miracle manage to parry one of them, you have to weave between the others to uh, get this rule. <laughs> yeah, he uses he hacks. He uses the freaking gun at the same time. You got your me at the mall, and the girl is cute. All I tried to use the dupe dupe glitch for my cousin using my cousin's Mew through a trade, and. We accidentally duped a Heratida and the Mew disappeared. <laughs> but I think he just game sharked it in anyway, so he just got another one. You just want the claws, no, you have to you have to do all the things the game wants you to do first. No fun allowed. Nothing of value was lost. Heratida best Pokemon. They really wanted to show off this map, didn't they? With this boss room. <laughs> Man, we spent so, so much time modeling these rocks and leaves and gravestones. Please look at them. Every time you die and have to walk back from the shadows of Yarn. Look at those snakes, aren't they great? God's creatures. Be God's beautiful creatures. What the fuck was that? <laughs> this is your favorite from soft level. Are you okay, Ian? Is everything all right? You good? Oh, beautiful pop in. It's awesome. Uh huh. <laughs> Very inspired. I like the part where there's snakes. It's like the Lost Woods, but spookier. The Lost Woods for masochists. Charlie! Bubba! Yeah. Are you a chubba bubba? Yes, you are. <laughs> Dark! <laughs> You're about to commit crimes! Are you gonna play the music box? Alright, what's the strat here? Just ascend. Just become as god. Okay, sick damage. Alright, now we know that isn't worth it because I have no points in skill. I have no skill. So, don't have to worry about silly little things like parrying in the BL4 room. How am I alive? Nice. Okay, I think about now is the time. Might want to pick up the save. I don't know when to. I, I checked my save. I, I backed up my save just in case, but I don't think I've used a ton of health actually. No, I'm not gonna level up yet. See, the thing is, this could very well be a wall for me, but I think a lot of the bosses after it would not be as much of a problem as this is for me. I just never am good at gang style bosses. Way too impatient to be freaking dodging around 20 minutes to get one hit on one of them while you're dodging the other two. The ones I'm most concerned about in the base game are this, Rom, and the one reborn. Yeah, I don't like Rom. <laughs> but the thing with Rom is you can kind of just bolt paper and beast blood pellet and whale on her potato body. This is, yeah, I can imagine this being a nightmare for no hit. Excuse me, no summons in this game. I mean, there are, but no summons in this run. It's considered one of the easier no hits. Is it because the uh, just one run through the game is pretty short reason? In general, or...? I 
I would never try to no-hit this. That's too stressful. This is more than enough stress. Uh, I think they're strength scaling. Might want to double check. Oh, any percent, yeah. Yeah, how many bosses is any percent? I think it's a lot. Oh, Murgo. Oh, really? You don't even need to do Garmin? If they're still, you're gonna cry. Suboptimal! Unacceptable! I think they're strength, but I'm not sure. Oh, bad end. I don't remember. I think we go back to hitting the wizard, because that was that was going uh, the best. For all man. Uh! Is it you? Yes. There's two fiery boys. Stop getting hit so much by the everything. <laughs> by the everything. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so BSB. Would you need it for. Yeah, you need one of the two. Is BSB easier to no hit than Cleric Beast? That is very short, though. Oh, that's all right. Here, why? Because then you gotta go through all the gold yarn and with the guns and stuff. Oh, so you don't have to turn echoes. Yeah, it's... Yeah, it's... Yeah, I don't know, that's just a level of masochism that's beyond me. It's impressive when people do it, but it's just such dedication to one game, even when it's your favorite game. And I feel like trying to perfect a game to that extent would just make me not enjoy it anymore. Even with some of the BL4 strats, that's why I don't want to push too too hard into this. Um, like just chewing through things with the, the beast blood pellets and the fire papers and stuff, it's like why would you ever play the game another way if you can play it so optimally? Thought about doing no damage for Sekiro, but no, yeah, no, no hits a whole different, whole different story. At least in Sekiro you have uh, the parry. Oh, this is such the, the honestly, this would be fine if the boss route was like half of the length it is. Just such a waste of time. I wonder if it is faster to just reload my save here. Probably not. It is. <laughs> I might do that then. Just sick of running. Oh. It's like 20 seconds. Wait, so do you do? I gotta figure out how to do it. This is the one I had right before the boss, right? Yeah, it's like 316, like an hour ago. Copy to system storage. 
Yeah, I didn't do anything else, right, between now and then? Depends on how fast you load, I guess. <laughs> It's just this boss route in particular that is the worst. Like I can't think of a boss route. Maybe there maybe the Ligarious one. Yeah, PS5. Is PS5 this slow with Bloodborne though? Yeah, I don't think this is faster. It's the you get sit through the I don't know, it's tough to say. You get sit through the start. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's probably the SSD. So apparently I backed up my save there instead of <laughs> further down. I can't trick you. I wasn't trying to trick you, potato. I was just curious. <laughs> it seems about the same time someone is well this room in. This fight's so boring. You're just kiting them constantly. Just trying to single them out. And like anytime you get a better opening for damage, you just get clogged from someone off the fucking other side of the screen. Like if you go for any more than one hit, you just eat shit. You play Elden Ring on the Series X and it loads pretty quick. Yeah, Bloodborne in particular had infamously long load screens for some reason, and this is after they patched it to load faster. It's just, uh, for whatever reason. I gotta open the window again, it's getting toasty. I think I might put some music on for this boss, because this boss's music is not good. It's, like, very forgettable. One of the weak spots in the soundtrack. And it is a long run, a long quiet run outside of the snake hissing. Music to die in an elevator too. What's up, Todd Howard? How you doing? Welcome. I almost think the music isn't loud enough because the sounds are too loud. Getting the Dota edition. Have <laughs> you seen if there's their nice plan? Probably in Dota. You got Japanese whiskey? What type of. What's special about Japanese whiskey? You fix it, what you fix him? What are you fixing? This is good running running from the snakes music. You fucking luggage! Oh no. Whiskey. Ah! <laughs> it's 
Some of the best in the world. Fancy. You wanna go to Japan? I mean, it's open. It's just a billion dollars to go there. It's just a billion dollars. Maybe it is faster to just wiggle <laughs> It's usually made in a coffee still and has a Swedish clean flavor without being sickly sweet. So it's just a quality beverage. All around. From the sounds of it. Ah! This is very fun and exciting. Riveting game. Ah! <laughs> I hate this boss. I hate them. I hate them so much. I wish Shadows of Yarnum a very much go to hell. We should gamba on what? How many tries it'll take me? I lost. I lost track already. <laughs> We've already been here an hour. This one's gonna be a wall. No, I, I, I even, uh, even if I were level forty, this would be bullshit. This is just, this is boss just bullshit. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm gonna die to crow. You don't know where the Yarnum Hunter? Oh yeah, they they took me a weird uh, bit to find too. You gotta like go down from up above. There's you gotta like from Central Yarnum. There's some barrels you gotta roll through. But I forget how to describe where they are. And then you drop down to the sewers from up above. This is just the training arc. Is it past the lichens? I don't remember! <laughs> I don't remember. I don't think it's on the bridge. I'm trying to like make a mental map of where it is and it's not working. Remember, do you remember? Nope. He's looking for the uh, hunter outfit. And I know you gotta drop, you gotta roll through some barrels and drop down. Man, Vicar Amelia was so easy. <laughs> this is just like rip! <laughs> difficulty curve. I swear the worst part is the run them. That's gonna be half the time. Alright, I can't see where Fireboy is. That just fucking homed around the pillars, sir. That ain't fair. Sometimes you can get a cheeky little transform attack in there if you like really want to live on the edge. Feeling, feeling a little, little frisky. You get a little, little R1L1 in there. Ow. I'm stuck. <laughs> oh. Whoop. Look at this dumbass in the back hitting the tombstone. Did you even go to wizard school? He didn't play Hogwarts. Ow! That's a very nice back of the tombstone. I'm very well acquainted with that. Come over here. <laughs> I didn't- I didn't need that health anyway. Health is for- health is for schmucks! <laughs> I 
don't want him in the corner. Ah! Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> I swear, the places they put the tombstones on this arena are like in the perfect spot to just get caught on constantly. There's just so much shit to keep track of in this fight. You gotta keep track of each of them in multiple phases, and you gotta keep track of where the tombs are that you can't see. You found it very good. Was it with the help of Rusu's amazing directions? Did I mention I haven't played Bloodborne in four years? <laughs> <laughs> Help. Maybe I should go see if I got better gems. Maybe I have better gems. Maybe that'll be that'll help. Maybe. Maybe it's maybe it's just it's just my gems. It's not the fact that I'm getting hit by everything. It's been 84 years. It's been one week. Is the music too loud? Is it acceptably bumping? Anyone have a preference? Is this the way? Everything looks the same. You've seen one snake, you've seen them all. Is it this way? You remember where it is? Yeah, it's by the, the troll god. I'm getting weird, like, screen tearing, which is pretty sexy. Okay, I definitely went the wrong way. Um, where am I? What thing? <laughs> it all worked out. Everything according to plan. Music successful. Thank you, man. Where did I go? This is not where I wanted to go at all. It's okay, we'll get some stuff while we're lost. My brain just is on autopilot, and it's not helping. Man, why would you play any other Soulsborne game? When you, they, you can't, you can't trick your weapon. It's just, it's just not the same. All right, we're here. It's a little bit of a roundabout route, but we made it. After I die, uh, I'm gonna go back to the to home. Let's see if I can get any, squeeze any little bit of damage out of here. I think I'm doing decent damage. I think I just uh, die to everything. stamina management because that has killed me multiple times. This requires so much fucking focus. <laughs> like my brain is not wired to focus like this on anything. Can't heal unless I'm hiding. Thinking about transforming there, but he seems to have re examined his life choices. Well, you 
someone did. attack through each other. <laughs> I'll be wailing on one and then the other one's just like like through his chest like fucking like Indiana Jones like rip his heart out like right through. Bullshit. Some bullshit. I don't like gank bosses in any of the games. Ornstein and Smo actually. Ornstein and Smo's okay. Because you can kind of kite them. You can kite these guys too, but... You also have a skill blood tinge at level max 80 on New Game Plus 5. A oh, skill blood tinge, blood tinge is good though. That's pretty common. People use the uh, Chicago right? I think I had one of those. Alright, I don't think I got better runes, but we're gonna take a little Luxie. Sorry, gems, no rings. Um. Wow, they all suck. <laughs> yeah. Um, I guess we'll get rid of this and get more stamina. I don't think that 3% defense is helping much. I mean, uh, is it stamina or? Oh, I don't have that one. Okay, we can do HP 5%, damage 3%. I don't know what negates more damage. The one that reduces all damage by 3% or the one that gives you 5% HP? Does anyone know which one of these actually lets you survive more? <laughs> I'm not sure. I feel like it would be the one that gives you more defense overall, but I don't know how the damage works in this game. I guess I guess this is better against physical attacks and not fire. I don't think there's much that's gonna help here, realistically. No one knows. Well, we came back here for nothing. A lot of nothing. I mean, I could still get a Bloodstarved Beast, too, if I wanted to, uh... If I want to do a normal path. More defense is usually better than more HP if you have static heals. Your heals are percent based. Ooh. So the HP. Oh, sorry, 10, 17. Wow. Ugh. Time flies when you're getting your ass kicked. He always has better viscerals and more echoes. Unless you're specking for a specific fight. Yeah, uh, I don't think the viscerals thing, I don't think I have it. Here it is. I think I have the one that gives you more echoes from viscerals, but not like does more damage. The viscerals don't seem worth it on BL4 for this unless I'm missing something. Because you don't seem to do much damage. Yeah, they don't seem very good.
Yeah, the, the I've seen for Orphan they do like the charged butt stabs a lot. But it seems like you're just ass gonna die if you do that on that. Shadows of Yarn and unless there's like one left. It's so hard to get in any openings for damage. A lot more fire resist. Not that it'll help all that much, but I don't think it'll hurt. Oh no, mine has fire resist. Never mind. Wait, so. Charlie, stop. Oh, they only have like about 10 difference. Charlie, stop. You need to get all the way to Amygdala? Wait, Chalice Amygdala or main game Amygdala? Thanks for sending me love, Charlie. She's being a hooligan. Don't encourage her. She's being a hooligan. You're being a hooligan. Stop being a hooligan. Stop turning on my desk. Thank you. Well, yeah, I think they're more of a new game plus weapon. <laughs> They, they seem more like a new game plus weapon. She's gonna distract me and get me killed here, here too. One boss just run around the fucking two. <laughs> Favorite game of all time, by the way. Oh, that was a cute one. Thanks for that one. Challenge runs would buy SSDs. Pay to win! Pay to win? Oh! Oh, you're running box! Help. How you doing, box? Box, did you do a BL4? I know you're a Bloodborne aficionado. Did you suffer through this too? Yeet. Yeah. I'm sure people probably use, like, can you get bolt paper here? Is it possible to get bolt paper here? Or is that just New Game Plus people do the bolt paper on the guys? We're in my dinosaur, and I was gonna play Exoprimal, but it got late. The, the Exoprimal open beta, I don't know if you saw it, it looks really clowny. Dinosaur is like dinosaur warframe or anthem. You did not be L4, you've only beaten it like twice. For shame. Put it on the unfinished list. I'm gonna have to consult Frostitute to put it on the unfinished list. I'm gonna get clocked if I H1 out here. Fuck. <laughs> I thought I was out. Ooh. Axeman noises. Oh, I'm just um, rolling the wrong way. 
Well, it do be awfully noisy back there. What's going on? Oh, what do we got? We got some snakes. You look forward to seeing that chaos? Yeah, it's it's in open beta now if anyone wants to play it for the weekend. Um, you just need a Capcom ID, which is kind of shitty. Were you rolling? That's a good question. You tried to join a game, but it got stuck in matchmaking. You only waited like five minutes. Yeah, I'm kind of concerned like the player base is not going to be great for it. I don't have any expectations for it. It just looks clowny. We jam and yeah, this, this is uh, Dance with the Dead. Get me the dead. Takes like five minutes to set up the account. Well, I don't think H did. I'm just gonna make an account. <laughs> to play the dino game with me. That I'll probably get bored of in like two seconds. Because <laughs> I have no attention span. And I sure do love the Shadows of Yarnum. Very well designed, fun, and exciting Bloodborne boss. They look like underneath their hoods. Oh, guess I'll die because I got stuck on the grass. Just one, just a single blade of grass. It's okay, I just chugged through uh, five miles? Was it five miles? More than five miles? Bloodborne's just like a dance. You just you just uh, jump in circles. <laughs> in a in a pattern. <laughs> Fearing for your life. Whoop! Whoop up the five five percent HP doing work there. Sir, can you please walk this way? Son of bitches! <laughs> There's some other streamers you watch, so if you can make parties with friends, hopefully you can play a few rounds. There. Starting with full team. Yeah, I think you can. You're also reading Stranger Paradise Final Fantasy Origin. Oh yeah, I saw someone posted that in Discord's coming to Steam. I didn't know it wasn't on Steam already. They're in the ailing Loran Chalice. I don't remember which one that is. Sorry, this isn't my place. Sir! If you use the cane, none of this would be happening. No, because you would be hiding like a little bitch behind the tombstone, hitting them through it. Is that why? Is that why, boss? That's what I did. <laughs> First playthrough experience. Was it Epic exclusive or something? Oh my god. Oh my god. He didn't deny it. Didn't, he didn't deny it. It took me like two hours on Father Gascoigne, so this is gonna be rough. I'm still in shock. Amelia died in like four tries. She was so easy. I don't know why she, she was just like way easier than I anticipated. Didn't even have to use fire paper, didn't have to use numbing mist. Didn't even find the numbing mist. You're not a crook. That sounds like something a, a crook would say. I've heard, I've heard some crooks saying saying some things like that before. Are we there yet? 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 I love running two minutes to a boss to die walking into the boss arena. You're just looking it up Epic had an exclusive for a while. Huh. Is it a good game? I just remember it being very memeable. 
it cringe, but like in a funny way. Oh, good, good. Good, good, very good, very good. Good, 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 good. Oh, oh, this step, they're still going. Look at these dumbasses stuck behind the tombstone. with the other fire guy. Ah! He didn't like that. Sometimes you can stagger him out of the animation. Sometimes you just eat shit and die. Most of the time I'm in the eat shit and die team. And then we got this weeb styling on me on the left. Exhausting. <laughs> Just like little baby steps around with my my baby stamina bar for babies. I'm trying not to die. Plinking away with my toothpick. Thank you. And then dying in two hits. Taking ten years to blood boil. Me uninstall the game. <laughs> this is like... Oh, that that guy with the go-go gadget arm. I hate him so much. Like even outside of BL4, I have died to him so many times. Stop! 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 Let me heal, bruh! This guy's spamming. What the shit is this? Kill the mage first, they say. It'll be easy, they say. What's up? You see the <laughs> This mother fucking <laughs> He's absolutely the worst. Like, what is that shit? Cut that shit. Cut the shit. Tell me that is not bullshit. Just stay close to him. Just just stay close to him, Shrimpy Doodle. Just just stay close to him, then he can't do that. You can't do it if you stay close. Uh, I think I have to kill him first. I think I have to kill him first because he always gives me the most trouble in the next phase. Can you parry it? Maybe, but it's really awkward because it goes forward. So, like, you have to be so far away to parry it. <laughs> and then you can't close the gap, I think. Hi streamer, I'm a Bloodborne expert. I'm happy to provide tips on how to beat this boss. What is what is your what, what's the pro tips? Everyone share your pro tips. An expert is here. An expert has arrived to save me from this hell. I don't know. I'm thinking I gotta freaking Oh get oh get good! Oh man, I, I, I didn't think of that one. Eat shit and die. I've been doing that. I've been doing it, it's not working so well. It's not working out, it's not working out like I wanted it to. Internet experts. There are, there sure are a lot of them. 
And then he got all Reddit and someone's like, man, Shadows of Yarnum was real easy on BL4. I don't know why, what people are complaining about. I beat it my first try. I was playing with my dick on the controller. I don't know what the problem is. Prevent your HP from reaching. Oh, oh, yeah. I need another rune to give me more HP. Like a date at the gym. It's just not gonna work out. Do people date people at the gym? Just play more Dota. Oh yeah, that'll do wonders for my wonders for my mental health right now. The lack of penis. Oh yes, that's why I can't beat it. Because I don't have a penis. I knew it. I knew it. I know people probably use beast blood pellets here, and they go super aggro and just stagger the shit out of them. But I ain't about that life. Alright, the fire one's gonna be a problem. Like, that one, because his fire does a lot of damage. They kind of stagger easy. You just go for like one or two hits. On this episode of I Shouldn't Be Alive, the Shadows of Yarnum. Balls gently like wafted there. My back! My back! I can't see this guy. Stop! Stop, sir! And heal it, sir! Sir! on fire. Man, this boss sucks ass. Who designed this? I'd like to file a complaint. You gotta go to bed. Thanks for hanging out, Potato. I hope you sleep well. Yeah, it's just a matter of... That's why I don't know if I'll do a full playthrough of BO4. I said that from the start. It's just a matter of uh, having the patience to beat your head into the wall. You designed this! Inspector Gadget. No. no. This is the worst. And then there's Rom. <laughs> and then there's Rom, the vacuous potato. If you were a doctor, you would have more patience. Thank you, Risu. Thank you. I don't know, when you guys fight this, who do you take out first? The Axeman? I think he's the fourth Shadow of Yarnum. I'm tilting. Nice flop, thank you. I'm tilting, I'm molding. Can I not go up there? Why did I do that? Whichever one's like, oh my god. <laughs> it's 
See, Bloodborne also has the weapon tricking, and it helps, uh, it's, it's, it's a stress relief, stress relief mechanic to just do this when you're pissed off. <laughs> Pretend they aren't snakes but home dogs. I don't think that'll help. Home dog? Home dogs? Home dogs of yarn? I need that little bit of HP because that gives me a little bit more damage too. Oh. I guess we'll just take out the mage then. People said the mage? I remember when I was like originally struggling against him because uh... That way you don't have to keep track of projectiles or something. But then some people said you bring them all low equally, so you don't have to deal with all of them at the two of them at max HP. Okay, nice sick sick trick attack. From downtown! wouldn't be nearly as annoying if the run back to it wasn't 10 years long. Simply parry, but it does nothing. It does nothing. Because I don't do damage from my viscerals, and I can't charge R2, because as I try to charge up an R2, they're like, ah, ah, snakes, ah, around me. Like, maybe when there's one left. Snake, soul, snake. Exactly. Risu, Risu understands. Risu's a Bloodborne player. Age played Bloodborne up to the Cleric Beast. My screen is like flickering on and off weirdly, and I don't know why. I don't know if you guys have noticed that. There's just like random black lines sometimes. Very strange. At least we didn't get clocked by the axe man. That was that was a minor victory. Must be your monitor. He actually beat the cleric beast. He made a beautiful character too. I still have it on here. Well, let me know if, if it looks like the screen is gonna explode. I don't think it's my monitor. It might be there something going on because I got the new USB capture thing for the webcam. So I don't have to use the freaking Logitech anymore that was giving me connections. I'm gonna be some consoles. He's the one. He's a god. I'll give this a few more tries because it's getting late. And my brain is not capable of <laughs> suffering with this boss, I think. The later it gets. Yeah, I'm so tempted to top off that little be bit of HP, too. Because of how many times I survived with a sliver of HP. Would 
You literally can't get more than one attack off. I hate this hit and run shit. Is there a way to play this boss like this is actually a Bloodborne boss where you, you bob and weave? And aggressively like dance with them? It doesn't feel like that. Call them bad names. Does he have a gadget arm? No. There it is. Can't even heal. Can't even heal. I think I have to to heal in that phase. I think I have to unlock and literally run to the opposite side of the map and shove the blood vial up my asshole because it's not working any other way. Amazing beast paws. You got two brain cells and they're both fighting for third place. That's the only way to play that weapon. Hi, Nero. How are you doing? Good to see you. Why aren't you playing this blindfolded, upside down, hands tied, and on a DDR pad? Did you see, Nero, did you see that girl, woman, the woman who was uh, playing Elden Ring with the freaking dance pad and PC at the same time? <laughs> Why, why even do challenge runs, guys, when people like that exist? Now she's playing with a dance pad and a, an acoustic guitar at the same time. That's her new thing. It's like, okay, guess I'll just be over here with my BL4 run, <laughs> feeling like a noob. <laughs> yeah, she's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. I can't imagine how much like, practice it takes to do that. Feet! Gross. Gross. Yeah, she played Elden Ring with a- she played two- two versions of Elden Ring at the same time. So she was fighting Melania on one version using a dance pad on a, and on another version using PC keyboard and mouse. Or maybe controller? I think it was keyboard and mouse, but... She was playing two different versions of the game at the same time and beat the bosses. Yeah, that's that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> she is ridiculous. Can't imagine playing one game that much to get that good at it. Because, like, people- some people are naturally good at the games, but there's no way anyone is naturally that good at the game. I mean, <laughs> Yeah, with the fist weapon, thank you, Doodles. I also had 99 strength. Yeah, I mean, I guess you get some sort of... You get accomplishment, feeling of accomplishment out of it, but... That's a level of masochism that I just cannot comprehend. I really can't. Uses this little tenitrous thing. I don't know if it's a tenitrous, but it looks like one. His wizard stick. That this is an extra challenge run because I haven't played this game in four years. <laughs> so this is like extra stupid. Whoa! Nice! You see that? That was all calculated. Through the fire and the flames. get hit in the butt from 20 miles away. I'm trying to 
an alternate strat. It's called being stupid aggro. Okay, it's not working. Yup! Oh! Whoa! 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 <laughs> Whoa. We should do Cuphead co op with dance pads, you please. <laughs> Why would you throw up from the exertion? Uh... Huh. How do we deal with that? I don't know how to deal with that. The extendo arms. I don't know how to deal with that. It seems like the only way you deal with that is you be super aggro, but while you're being- unless you get both of them in the aggro, you just eat shit. Carefully, thank you. <laughs> See, the thing is with Bloodborne, it encourages reckless, aggressive gameplay, but the BL4 run doesn't seem to do that. So I don't know what to do here. <laughs> that's, that's what they pay you the big bucks for anyway. Bloodborne advice. Goodness. It's fine, it's fine. We got this, we got this. Just take ten years. It takes ten years to beat this so I can go to Reddit and, and see all the people who beat it first try and feel nothing. <laughs> it's so funny, like any any accomplishment you make in a video game, if you go to Reddit, you'll find someone who's willing to kick the wind out of your sails. Like, there's a guy on Reddit who BL4 New Game Plus 6, no roll, no sprint, no parry, whatever, beat the game. Thanks, Reddit. <laughs> oh, yeah, I bet. I bet. It's pretty crap. <laughs> I mean, sometimes it's cool. Like, it is impressive what people do um, in these games. Like, I, like the Levy Solo guy, that was cool, but at the same time, it's like, it, it is just a video game. That was probably lethal? His world's first. I don't know, it was just some guy on Reddit. You've never died. You can't die if you don't play. She's a god. I just want to trick my weapon and then I just attack into the way of death. This boss has given me, like... This boss... It's just like a visual depiction of my Ajita right now. Oh, sick jump. Ooh, is it snake time? I'll run out of stamina and die. In a corner. Ooh, 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 ooh. Also, the sound effects they make are very triggering. They're like, hoo, hoo, hoo. Oh, it's okay. I didn't want to run anyway. I didn't want to be alive. Oh, I knew that was coming. Oh, thank you. Good night, Holvo. Sleep well. Don't dream of the shadows of Yarnum because they suck ass. I wish shadows of Yarnum the very go to hell and never come back. Excuse me. This is your favorite boss, Toodles. Why? <laughs> because that's making me suffer the most. These guys took you several hours. 
Yeah, they're rough. All the gang, gang squad bosses are rough. Is there a gang squad boss in these games, guys, that's easy? It's, it's just having to keep track of multiple targets at once requires so much focus, especially on lower levels. Because you just can't get hit. But even le like at a proper level for this area, they're rough. Your new favorite boss will be the one to extend the spring. I'm so sleepy. I don't have to work tomorrow, but I do have to get my eye examined. I have to go to the guy with the weird painting. <laughs> I never posted that in the Discord. The eye doctor has a really creepy painting. I sent it to Toodles. He's a really creepy painting, and I didn't comment on it because it had his last name on it, so I think he painted it himself. But it's like of these twins, just... I think they're twins, or it might be mother and daughter, standing side by side, just like lifelessly staring. So I went to this guy my first appointment, and that was on the wall, and he's like, can I dilate your eyes? I'm like, sure. So my eyes were just like... And just blurred, seeing this creepy ass painting on the wall. <laughs> he left me in there alone. It was like the start of a horror movie. It's probably his family, it is. He probably painted it himself. Just say cool painting and see what he says. <laughs> I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna know the backstory. I don't wanna engage. This is the same guy who, who told me that the recommended temperature for the, uh, the hot water, or sorry, the warm water eye compress is baby bottle warm. And I'm like, bro, I've never warmed a baby bottle in my life. Do I look like I've warmed a baby bottle? Like, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Baby bottle warm, like, give me a temperature. Sir. I like to tell my my patients that a baby bottle warm compress. What the fuck does that mean? Oh sick. Sick transforms transform attacks. I don't like the spicy Cheeto man either. I don't like any of these guys. I don't like the weave, I don't like the wizard, and I don't like Spicy Cheeto, man. They all suck. I think I have to play more aggressive than I am, then. I don't know. God, those of you who've watched BL4, do people go super aggro on these guys? How do, what's the trick? Or do they play kind of like I'm doing? I'm just kind of curious overall if it's more aggro. Oh, baby bottle pops. Nice. Classic. Oh, sick. I hear him behind me. Oh. Oh. You gonna do it again? You gonna you gonna do it again? You won't, you won't. Like, I straight up just forget the strat. Hi! You think you're hiding over here, you son of a bitch? Son of a bitch! Like, what the fuck? I hear the one behind me. It just seems like if I'm lucky to get them apart, that's when we win. But there's no way of, of kiting them. Like... There's no way. <laughs> You're stress eating crescent sticks waiting. Command you to get back to you with proof so you can nap before getting up for fun. When were you gonna nap? As soon as I get back to you. One more. Then enough. One more. 
think I can do it. I just have to... I think this one I might actually have to watch a strat for. Because this has always been a thorn in my side. And with how to juggle their movement. I can't remember if you're supposed to take out one or get them all kind of like half low. And then take out one. Yeah, that's what I- I can't remember what it is. Can't even get there. <laughs> We're still on the second phase. Before the big snake problem. What is it with the flickering? It's so weird. There's just random lines. It's in like specific areas running through here. Seeing it. I'm gonna go check the VOD because it's very subtle, but it's definitely there. Not that I'm not believing you, <laughs> just it's, I think it's, it might be too subtle for you guys to see in a smaller window. I have it like blown up in my face. So. I, I, it's not the monitor because it's in specific spots when I'm running. You are a little drunk. Yeah, that too. <laughs> That's okay. while you were drawn? Which one? Ooh. Charlie! Did you fix your thing, Age? Age! Did you fix your thing, Age? Well, if I really guess that nerves it down. <laughs> What are they? What are they? Yeah, what are the fat rolly guys? You know, you know. Don't give it back. Thank you, boss. Thanks for the moral support. More! I'm just too tired to focus on this. I almost fell off the elevator. Oh, God skin. Oh, boy. He sucks. Wait, did you kill him just now, Endrick? Or did you kill him another time? Wait, I know how to summon age Dota 2. You guys hear about this hit game called Dota 2? Anyone know? Anyone know about Dota 2? In the chat? <laughs> you might actually be playing. Tell us more. Yes, it's a it's a indie game by a little company known as uh, Bell, owned by a guy uh, you probably haven't heard of him named uh, Gabe Gabe Newell. Toodles is an ex Dota professional. Toodles used to like <laughs> my my memories. Toodles of, of playing Dota with you. You were like talking with a friend doing something else, and you just like clicked your character to auto follow. <laughs> And you're like, don't die. <laughs> That's my memory. That's my memory of Dota with Toodles. <laughs> you're still fixing. What were you? You still fix? Are you gonna stop? Are you gonna you fix all night? I got like one more Shadows of Yarnum run in me. This is this is uh, rough. I gotta I gotta watch a strat. No shame because I need all the help I can get.
<laughs> I don't want to play Mario Party right now, dudes. Not right now. We gotta play it together. Okay, this is this motherfucker, Duncan. Duncan Yonuts over there. She's busy! She doesn't want to play now. She's got a pack. Can we- can we all not be like in the freaking corner? Oh, you're oh, okay, you're stressing. Did you did you want to play Mario Party? Is that what you're asking? Do you need distraction? Oh my time! is here, but I think it involves me dying. What are you fucking... Can you not? Do not hand. Do not gadget arm. Do not gadget arm. I need to regain my stamina. That was like almost all of my HP bar. I'd just like to point that out. Woo! Tag team. If you stay close to him, but you gotta watch out for fucking Tweedledoo over there. Can we not? Can we? Can we quit it with the extendo shit? Can we? Can we stop overcompensating, fellas? All right, no fellas. Gonna do it again. He's gonna do it again. I can feel it. Yep. Cool. That little like faint attack is so bullshit. That's so bullshit. It's bullshit. Bullshit. It's bullshit. <laughs> stopped that's a sign that's a sign oh bloodborne hmm maybe this is where we level up i'm debating i'm still debating it might be better just to do a regular playthrough and then try blood level four after but i don't know please did you want to play a dota age you still fixin did I throw myself into the meat grinder again? I should probably go to bed, but I kind of don't want to even though I'm very tired. Yeah, for de-resting, but the problem with that is like, I was never good, so like, <laughs> the de-resting can only go so far. That's- that's the main issue with that. Um, I don't know. H. H. Monogtos. H. H. You're Dota leaving? Okay. 
Spicy sure, sure. <laughs> or I could play the dino game. It's so quiet without the music. You really want a Dota? Probably not. Dance with the Dead Super Mix. Yeah, I probably shouldn't, realistically. Well, that was fun. Are you gonna be able to play it all this weekend? I don't think we're going to New Hampshire because it's gonna be 30 degrees. Uh, I just, I, we found out. But um, I'm gonna be busy all on Saturday. No, that's a Fahrenheit. <laughs> oh, what, what is that? I read that as what is that in Celsius? Yeah, it's gonna be cold. <laughs> it's gonna be very cold. So, uh, we would have to be inside the whole time, which kind of defeats the purpose of going away. And the other thing is, it's, uh, they finally got snow up there. Oh, hold up! My vials. Good thing we made a backup. That's happening with some. Thank you so much for the raid! Sorry, I'm yawning. What were you playing tonight? Oh. What are you playing tonight? Well, come on in. I think something's going on with my capture card. I'm having weird artifacts on my screen. I don't think it's the monitor. Are you playing Darksiders? Nice no, job, too. I went some. Living your best life. That's good to hear. It sure is a game. <laughs> Uh, is that a is that a good thing or a bad thing? Do you want to Dota? No, no, I'm not gonna force you into Dota. I'm reloading my save. Select. Copy. Yes. It's definitely a game that you can play. That's a rave, rave review. Well, I hope I hope you had a good stream with the game that you can play. GeoGuessr, I don't think I'm still subscribed to GeoGuessr. I, th I think that might have expired long ago. Maybe it's my cable. I think it's the PlayStation that's cable that's having an issue. Hmm. Hey. Have you played this, Winsome? I don't think anyone wants to watch Dota. <laughs> That's the thing. I gotta, I gotta wrap up if we Dota. You love Bloodborne. Awesome. What's, what sort of, um, what sort of build did you do? What sort of weapon you use? Or did you do like multiple playthroughs? Oh, you never want to replay it. Okay. <laughs> Did you really want a Dota age? You seemed very reluctant. So I'm not gonna push it. But it would probably be off stream. You're busy fixing the luggage. Fuck, it's done now. Huh? Oh, I didn't turn the music off while this is awkward. Streaming, it's only fair. Trippy! Trippy! <laughs> we can if you want, but I don't. I don't know if anyone wants to watch Dota. Realistically, ah! I, I think my mental capacity for Shadows of Yarnum might be out. For the evening. <laughs> this ball. 
bosses. Okay, just phase through the fireballs. Did you want to play Flog? No, I don't. I don't have it installed. You really don't want to play the Dino game? Flog. I also have the Dwarf game. Oh. So one fun thing about Bugborn is if you hit if you hit the dodge button while you're running, uh, you jump. And I believe you take extra damage while you're jumping, is that correct? <laughs> so you just eat shit and die. I'm pretty sure you take extra damage while you're jumping. Play TF2, I also don't have that instrument. Man, I can't wait to start up start up work on Young Master's Unexpected Cute Wife next week. It's gonna be great, guys. I'm gonna have so many fun stories to tell you. And guess what? The main character's already pregnant. They always get pregnant. If there is a <laughs> if there's a book and it, the main character is a woman and it's a romance, they're always gonna get pregnant. In these books, it's just just how it goes. Boy, howdy, do I love pregnancy stories. I still can't get over the fact that they described the male lead like legit one of the words was Sundere. They just wrote he was Sundere. <laughs> no, it's not erotica. It's not. It's just shitty Chinese web fiction. I don't know, maybe it's the fantasy for them, I don't know. I don't know. Smoochie books with a side of body horror? I mean, I wish it was uh, was body horror, that'd be more exciting. I hope it's not my new capture card that's frying my computer. Also, my monitor to do weird things right now. Syndrome misogynist man, preggers lady, and green tea bitches. <laughs> I don't know the green tea bitches. I didn't look up coffee bitches or black tea bitch or whatever the other bitches were. It's the Chinese equivalent of a pick me girl. Uh, Shadows of your <laughs> Oh. Yep. Uh, yep. That. Uh, yep. I ain't no holla back girl. I ain't no holla back girl. I ain't no holla back girl. <laughs> wow. Nice pride dumpers. Nice dumping. What's going on with me? You remember really hitting this boss? This boss is the one of the worst in the game. It's tied again between him, these guys, Rom, and the the one reborn. I think are the worst, not including the Chalice bosses, which are a whole another level of bullshit. I had some fun like stuff in here. I'm looking to see if it is my monitor that's freaking out, or if it is. Uh, you're going to bed, box? It's only 11 to 18. Rizzo! <laughs> you ship Shadow of Yarn of 1 with Shadow of Yarn of 3. Which, which one is which? I can't tell them apart, they're all the same. You guys remember mistakes? You guys remember mistakes where, man? Just remember mistakes we were made. She was great. Stick driver character. What else we got in here? Well, that's, that's pretty good. Who goes to bed? This is cool. A 
glitch this guy out up here, I think. In the chalice dungeon, he was just glitched up there. <laughs> the, the chalice dungeons are so buggy. So buggy. Excuse me, what should we do, guys? What should we do? Should we... Ugh. You gotta wash dishes! Gee, sure, you hope the stream isn't over. I mean, if we Dota, then you can just Dota leave, and then you don't have to worry about it, right? Is that how that works? I don't even remember these. I'm trying to find the one- it's supposed to screen cap when you get the plaid, right? Is it this? Ah, I did it. <laughs> this is great. I love this this screenshot commemorating the platinum trophy of the game that's just a black screen. <laughs> <laughs> trophy earned, black screen. Sick. Definitely, yeah, definitely a moment. Sure, it sure is a memorable moment. Look at how gorgeous this game is. Look at this shit. Look at this beautiful potato. I love beautiful potato. I guess we could do a dodo. I don't remember. Oh, it just screen caps all of your trophies? Auto automatically? Look at the wrinkly potato boy! Wow, this is like nostalgia field trip here. If this is just it screen caps whenever you get a trophy. That's fun. It's proof though, I did it. I, I done did it, I got the platinum. It's proof. Ailing Loran Charles. I did it. Where's Orphan? I think this is Orphan. This was so agonizing. Oh my game and gosh. I think Orphan took 200 tries. If I remember correctly, it took a few hundred. It was bad. With the boom hammer. Pizza cutter Lawrence, as he deserves to be treated, shredded into pepperonis. Look at this little potato! My character looks so cool, too. Look at the wings, furry. Oh, it's going on there. Okay, anyway. Like, none of the other, like, the Graphically, it's not as intensive as Elden Ring, but art design-wise, I don't think anything in Elden Ring looks anything near as good as this. Like, lighting and everything. This looks cool as fuck. Is that Braider's Horse? It is. It is. Coolest outfit. This- oh. <laughs> Wow, you're streaming late. What you up to tonight? Hell from the Spuria. Very nice. Very nice. I hope you had a good stream. Hi, man. Hi, man. See, we're getting raided. We're getting raided. I'm sorry. We're probably going to switch to Trendy one game of Dota 2. I apologize in advance. What's that? But, uh, yeah, I hope you guys are doing well. Having a good night. Elden Ring has very few genuinely distinct- Yeah, a lot of it does blend together. The story and how it's executed. Yeah, I, I was saying earlier, H, I was listening to a five-hour audiobook of Bloodborne 4 <laughs> that I found called The Pale Blood Hunt. I just started listening to it, and even like in the first ten minutes, it's like, wow, that's so cool that this stuff is able to be pieced together like that. Um, so what, what's going- No, it isn't even Vatsy video. It was someone else who wrote like a really long essay, and then they narrated it. 
Um, what's going on here is I died with one HP. Like, with the boss with one HP. <laughs> That's why I screen capped that, I remember now. The boss should be dead, but I was dead. Um, and that boss is like the worst boss in the game. In the chalices. I think this is one of the endings. No. You're gonna do some shower? Have a good night, Risu. You're heading out. Have a good shower. Dead, dead Maria. I don't know if there's any like fun video clips. What is this? This is probably an embarrassment, is what it is. Oh, I was playing without the hood. I'm messing around with that. I don't remember any of this. Church pig is just like fucking shreds everything. Because you could get the trip church pick in the DLC. You may be back. Oh, I don't know how long I'm gonna be on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sort up uh, Dodi, I think. She's just kind of a big pushover. I don't remember her being such a pushover. It's it's funny how much certain bosses trip you up on first playthroughs and then they're not difficult ever again and then there's shadows in your arm. <laughs> then, then shadows of your arm is a thing. Look at how good the game looks without a hub though. This is a private way? Trish pick is my favorite weapon. <laughs> this is such a sloppy run too. But you can snipe her head with it. You're working! Gross! I like you're doing okay, despite having to work. You do night shift, by the way? Oh, I guess it's, it's earlier, earlier where you're at. Maybe? I can't remember if you're in Texas or if that was someone else. Day and night always work. Oops. Oh, so she healed in this one. And then she just died. She just dies. God, the moveset of this weapon is so fun. Unless everyone dies instead of gets sick and injured. That's not something you want. Okay. I'll th I'm gonna I'm gonna do a good thinking on uh I didn't want to rest it, I wanted to sleep it. Um I'm gonna do a good thinking about Shadows of Yarn and Deal for. <laughs> well we'll see if it's doable. I'm not sure. So it's TBH. To DH, I'm not sure with my skill level. I maybe like if I beat my head into it. The last phase is gonna be scary. It's gonna be rough, I think. Not the key again, too. Maybe. Yeah. I'll get a second wind, surely. So sleepy. I think if I watch a strategy for the Shadows of Yarnum, I might be able to do it, but it seems like it's up to like, it's almost like luck if you're able to uh, pipe them around. Like, half a, most of the fight just seems like in managing them around the tombstones. Alright, well, 
thank you everyone for watching Bloodborne. I'm gonna play one game of Dota 2. If you would like to Dota Leaf, I will not take it personally. I gotta pee, too. Um, but I'll be quick, because I already fed Charlie and everything. Let me switch my stuff. You're still awake, Fox? Don't watch? That is a terrible game. Terrible game for nerds. Look at this one now. Game capture. Capture. Capture the game. G game capture. Capture. Capture the game that you're supposed to capture. Hello? <laughs> Hello? It's just not. Oh, there it is. Okay. And then I got your dish. I don't know. Yep. Yeah. Gotta go all about right. Here. Tiny shrimpy. Yeah. Alright, I'll be right back. There's got the. This, this game window is not captured. Oh, there we go. Oh! Oh, hello! Hope I woke Charlie up. Charlie, this jerky is not for you, Bean. Alright, brace. Brace yourself. Hello. 
Yo, what the hell? You didn't even do the, 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 the you didn't even do the thing. Oh, I gotta claim the treasure. Buy a key. I wonder if I can beat Shadows of Yarn, I'm still thinking about it. What am I gonna get? It's time. Oh, I, I, yes! I get the Viper skin. Nice. Well, let me change the music to something a little more chill. Um, I was looking at used bidets on Craigslist. And I realized they're, they're trying- Why are bidets so expensive? It's a toilet seat. Like, I could understand like 100, 200 bucks maybe. Why are they like a thousand dollars? You know. Just get it on Amazon. We got one for like thirty bucks. No, no. I need, I need the 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 big I'm ass one. I'm sorry, you one. have the world's most delicate body. The no, no, no. You gotta get the one that like it like it's a whole a musical experience. You can like listen to your your best hits. And it plays for you, and it has a synchronized swimming. I would love oh. to try Shadows of Yarnum again, but it's definitely not happening tonight, considering a one-shot walking into the boss arena. <laughs> That's when you yes. know. It's just like, and you're done for tonight. They just slapped them. I can't stuff. wait for, for uh, Rom. I'm just like the belly flop potato. I might get Wendy's after this too, maybe we'll see. That. It's gonna be one in the morning. Yeah. Maybe I'll snack on something more healthy, because I just had like weird, like an egg and some to old, old toast. Um, yeah. Oh yeah, you get a time dork out for saying bad stuff about Wendy. Um. On-demand fart replays. Exactly, you can remix the fart replays. You're gonna carry shrimp because nope. of your stream. Yep. Nope. I'm gonna support you. Carries are boring as fuck to watch. Oh look, Box 95. 94. <laughs> 95. 95. Box 94. <laughs> wow, who the fuck is Box 95? He's an imposter. I'm Plus. so tired. <laughs> what else did I... Um, so yeah, I, my luggage was fucking busted, and I was like 3D printing a piece to fix it, and then like, I taped it up and like, used longer screws. I could also buy new luggage, but what fun is that? Dork, no one wants to grieve. That's just straight up grieving. Oh good, we have someone on our team just straight up called Hostile. Time to ban. Uh, Five seconds. Troll? I haven't, seen, I haven't seen someone play Troll in 50 years. Oh, well, Let's we lost because they picked Muerta and she sucks. I'm gonna just do this to block the sniper, okay? Have fun playing sniper. Fuck! <laughs> Against <You're> Pudge. <laughs> I played myself. Is it? Is it now? Yeah. We lost anyway because we got a Muerta and this hero sucks ass. Oh no, it's fine. No, no, I'm just gonna rush a rapier. Hey, it's me, Age. <laughs> I'm a I'm a slime VTuber. <laughs> you can catch me on my channel on Monday. Oh, by the way. Oh, that's the other thing I did. I was, um, oh, I got my sniper skin. Um, I'm doing um, the macaroni. Uh, ratings slowly. I'm like recording them on a spreadsheet all the ratings over the years. So finally, I'm I'm like one through basically one year. Huskar. Oh, Huskar. Oh God. Oh. Scam likely. <laughs> their name. Their name's Scam likely, and they have a Cagney carnation. <laughs> Avatar. <laughs> Okay, no way. I mean, 
one of those games. We got Team Dia de los Muertos here. We Why do I get the PA? I'm a fucking Phoenix! Oh, CMP, CMP. Why do I get the PA as my target? They're hard carry know. when I am a superhero. I'm like, fuck <laughs> this. Fuck something. everything about this. Yeah. This game Everybody sucks. Everybody gets set. This job's yep. finished. It's all your fault. This game does suck. Charlie has awoken. <laughs> Oh yeah, PA's gonna jump me, can't wait. I'm gonna get a four staff actually. To so counter that when she jumps you. Or I can just dive away, I'll save my dive for when she goes on me. Yeah, I'm gonna have a very expensive. I don't know if this is somewhere to carry your support. Oh hi. What is he doing here? On the tower, bro. 30 seconds to show time. I think it's a better four staff game than a Yule's game. Is this good against Pudge, too? It's also good against Husker. They have a lot of leaps. They usually get Yule's yeah, if they have a silence. Um, can you four staff or Yule's out of a, uh, out of CM's shit? Yeah. Yeah, but you can't, on. like, run away. Oh my god. There, there is there. I've got a feeling this is gonna be good. The way I lived. The way I lived. That wasn't weird. Got her. You better fucking run. I'm just missing. <laughs> yeah, you better fucking run. <laughs> I don't know why she didn't just finish that off. I made a mistake. I clicked the fucking creeps instead of them. I think I'm dead. Because I'm tanking a creep wave. It was all because of one fucking misclick. Welcome to Dota. <laughs> like, I, I tried to click the courier, I clicked the creep wave, and then the whole creep wave aggroed me around the fucking mouth. You can use the CM, yes, she's the only one. Four steps, way better. Trust me, I have 3,000 hours in this game. Don't worry, I got one creep. I'm on fire. Okay, I got first blood. Huskar is doing the Huskar thing where he just runs, runs at you.
Vivan, and yeah, I got the midnight going. Chilling. Being chilling. Age is playing a not. very skill heavy hero. Just out of region on the PA. I have abilities. So made glass. She's still not D-word the freaking pull camp for some reason. Six tangos that refuses to use a single one of them. Absolutely. Just waiting for her to get jumped on. Okay, I love that. I love that. That pull it was good. <laughs> he just fucked right off. Okay. Did you see the whole series 2 Chinese Dota okay. scene got banned for either hacking or match fixing, including typically played by TI? Wait, what? Whole oh, okay. right. scene? Yeah. Did that run spawn at 6 or 5? I never remember. I'm just gonna stand here and hope my Marta doesn't die, but she's probably gonna die. You say that every game. Someone Google this, please. <laughs> We're always it's like, 6 minutes. It's 6 minutes. It was, it was there. Okay, okay. We were there, we were all there when we saw it spawn at 6 minutes. Maybe sometimes it won't spawn at 6 minutes. Forty-six people? That's a nuts. Wait, what? Getting bam. The Dota scene is in shambles, I feel like. It's just a mess. Shambles. <laughs> like, ever since uh, the last TI, it's nice. just been a train wreck. Did he get more gold from that than I did killing him? to turned around. But that was a mistake. She also didn't buy a magic stick in the lane where they're like exclusively spamming spells from a distance. Oh. Alright, I think this is actually her first game trying to play the hero.
Oh, hi, DD fucking motherfucker. DD fucking fuck motherfucker. Oh my god, help yeah, me. Yeah, you look dead. I can't do anything. <laughs> I'm no do anything. I don't have a stun. The hero could. Is he helping? I don't know. He's thinking about it. Oh god. I'm just gonna click him and hope for the best. The Jakiro probably should have rotated, but I think he's lacking in the brain cell department. Why is everybody always lacking in the brain cell department? <laughs> I wrecked your fire. How you doing? Yeah, Muerta is not a good hero. That's, uh, that's the problem there. Oh, way, hey, big surprise. Somebody's on a roll. Huskar? Killing? There he goes, that killing again. Guess I'll lose half of my HP to save my idiot Muerta. Is that like a new sitcom? She's not doing much oh. of anything. <laughs> I can't do too much to harass here, I'm level four. Get this tone. Yeah, Shoot so fast! Fuck! Did you know? Did you know what? Oh, oh the mid <gasps> Yeah, we got the jams. The relaxing jams and age streaming. Did you know you have to S rank well. the entirety of Heavy. Cuphead before Toothles will acknowledge your existence? Oh, you're playing Metal Health thing? Oh, nice. nice. My camera's in a really weird spot, I just noticed, so I'll fix that. They kind of broke the higher difficulties. Did they patch something? Did they like rebalance something? Gold Rose won't be what? <laughs> 10, 10, 11 minute Roche? This guy fucking pranking? They all rotated. I gotta get some vision up there. I can't because they bought all the words. Okay, cool. <laughs> There's a Your top tower's hurting. I think we just let top go. Yeah, oh yeah. Finger, dude. Seven in a row. Eight in a row. Like, we need to slip push. We can't fight them. There goes your top tower. Oscar is still here. <laughs> He's got ages. Yeah, we lost because this Oscar is super fat at 12 minutes of the game. It's okay, we got the ages. Oh, still die. Uh, I think that guy's just out of control. I don't know how we deal with the Huskar. I mean, like a Heaven's Halberd. And, uh, I can't afford that. You just need to shoot faster and harder. Oh, 
nice, I got the last hit. <laughs> oh, she found She found the fucking Huskar, he's in every lane, guess we'll die. Can't hide in here, can I? Might want to check your bottom tower. Just win, it's that easy. Just win. Okay, so there's a possibility. Yeah, they're all looping bottom, and they're just dead here. Bottom tower's <laughs> in a tight spot. Can get the farm in there. So the Huskar's like in the woods. They to smash that bottom tower of yours. Oh, she went back in. She went back in. I'm just gonna sit here. This is awkward because, like, there's yeah, the Huskar's in the woods. There are some, like, scared. Yeah, he's still there. He's scared to death to leave. But the Luna, like, made the mistake of going in there. The other fellas aiming to wreck your bottom tower. A fond farewell to your bottom tower. I don't think we can kill him. <laughs> the loon is just cutting through the trees one by one. He yeah, is just farming somewhere. Everyone's just fucking, yeah, terrified. I'm probably dead here. The <laughs> Bruce just hiding in the trees in fucking terror. <laughs> well, we're trying to wait for we can I just put that there so I can see. <laughs> Singer got patched when they added the new difficulty. Oh. Oh, you think it bugged? It was unintentional? Here. Yeah, let's walk up the hill with no vision. That's a good idea. Okay, well, I get you. Oh, hi. Oh, big, big, big. I don't think I need a egg there, but it feels no, like no, it. No, no, no. It's definitely. I knew they had vision there the way they were moving that whole time. Everybody's streaming late tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have work off tomorrow, so I'm just suffering. Then get murked by the end boss first phase. <laughs> Unavoidable boss. Oh, that's not how it's supposed to be. That's what it felt like when I played the game. <laughs> that's that's not intended. I'm not playing very well because I'm tired, but we'll do our best. God, this fucking Oscar is like everywhere. Thirsty, guns. Where did he go? Nope, oh, he's. Oh, you did. Did you kill him? There's a man in the Three person only game. Just here, watch out for the hook. Them dire buildings are tough. Is a DD tall? Is a DD here? Is <laughs> there's a DD? Oh, he's DD. Yeah. He's taking it. Okay, that's fine. I just wanted to take that so we didn't get like a freaking P-A-D-D. Terror. We have here a 
courage to have another drink. It's not even the weekend yet, Reese. Possibility we can pull this out. Another one? Yeah, I don't know. There's a possibility. Time to die while placing a risky, cheeky ward. Oh. I'm a liver. Down. Is he rushing again? He might be rushing again. Top tower. Good luck getting out of this. Your mid tower needs a little help. How are you doing, Tavi? How was your stream? Thank you so much for the raid. Sorry it's Dota 2 that you raided into, but hi guys! Yeah, this this game is toxic. Hi, Tabby. Hi, Cactus. Hi, Wolf. I was gonna war. It'd be an awesome stream. Welcome. This game is pure suffering. Anyone play Dota 2? Anyone play a MOBA? Because if you don't, I would not recommend it. <laughs> I don't think yeah. I. Does the extension work on the screen? Did I get rid of that? The one that like you mouse over and it shows what the abilities do. I'm gonna get rid of that. You're good. Oh, the bub appeared. God of War was so good, lots of story tonight. Oh, glad you're enjoying it. There's a ton of good things about that game. Are you playing on PC? Push stop, push stop, push stop. Get my item. Oh, I'm gonna get this item next. Then we're gonna get a halberd for Husky. Thanks, Fenrir. Put the tutorial for League, that's enough to know. You gonna jump me, Pete? You gonna jump me? I have my. I can hear. Oh god. Ow. Oh, it's our friend. Oh! Oh, nice. nice. Big. Uh, okay. Oh! <laughs> okay. Gosh, it's I don't know what he said. It's morning! Oh, good morning! Good morning, everyone's in different time zones. Oh, and the escape. Tooltips works for you, but you can't remember if it worked for items. Oh, it isn't working for items? Huh. Interesting. Well, glad some of it works. It's a pretty cool extension. If you mouse over the abilities and the heroes, it should tell you what they do. But basically, uh, I'm playing Is that Phoenix. Auto update? Uh, I think? Like, maybe not. It's, yeah, it takes a lot of my focus. Yeah, totally understandable to have you get some rest. Thank you so much for the raid. Um, and thank you guys for the follows. Yeah, I figure most people go to bed this time of night, but thank you all for stopping by. And if you need to something to fall asleep to, you can listen to the soothing sounds of age screaming. <laughs> It doesn't work? Yeah, maybe add, add block. Did you in any way play T-L-O-Y? What is T-L-O-Y? Oh, the last one. Yes. The first one? I actually have a friend gifted me the little stuffed giraffe from the game. I have it on my dresser back there. Oh god, he's got a DD. Get the fuck out. No, oh, he's Aegis and DD. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Last of Us is great. Didn't play the remake, but I heard it was good. <laughs> Fresh mate. Well, this is terrifying. If we, if, we, if we link up here, we're fine. Oh god. Here he is. He has no fear. I walked into that. Guess you'll die. Okay, that's a Oh, okay. Oh! Oh, they just ran. Oh, maybe they see him. Oh, got to see him. 
my god you get oh, oh. oh of course <laughs> yeah of the bird course. was a lot no the crit i think you get crit by the no dagger. it's the fucking uh the huskers are just out of control so let's just say things are getting a little you do have the remake it's so beautiful it does look very good they did a good job with that hi carpool you'll play dota but not neo yeah this game makes me hate myself less than neo right does surprisingly radiant's gone and fortified their structures the problem is they're getting BKBs, and when they get BKBs, I just sit in the back and cry. Yo, he's got Boots of Trouble too. Oh my god. I'm also kind of half paying attention and playing like shit because I'm tired. Oh, okay! That's just literally one hit. One shot, easy. One shot! Just get a blade mail for him. Oh, you're right. You're right. Thank you. I will build that next. I'm sure that'll do great with your no HP. Your 1100 HP. Trouble. Are you telling me you're joking? Oh my god. I get the top towers getting all banged up. Look at I only had 12 so it's fine. We got the ages at least. This guy's just ratting. Rat lord up here. Yeah. Yeah, because he can go bot and hop. Yeah, me. he's got his freaking boots of travel. I'm gonna- I'll get him. No breaking through the dire structures for now. Should get a basher. Hey, what is good? Not Aegis build. Uh, this car can't search you with his basher. Let's get a, um... Halberd. How's a halberd? <coughs> yes, Toodle dictates what's good and what's bad. And what's bad. Blessings upon a loyal warrior. Blessings upon a mm -hmm. Blessings upon a blessing. That's not that's not how it go. Blessing. It's not. I'm trying to find the pudge with my face, but he's not here. I want to find- I want to kill this fucking idol, right? Oh man, I wish I was there. Man, this is such a worthless skill. I'm about to get hooked. Oh, I had a mango. Oh. That's great. I had a mango. Yeah, I just used it. Now I no longer have a mango. Mm-mm. Oh fuck. How scars block? How scars block? Remember when you could activate, um, you could activate the fucking things for heals? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was busted. That was well, at least he can't roach again, right? Is the pit lord TPing him around? Is that what happened? Yeah, they're like blood buddies flying around the map. There he is. Where you at, Sniper level. Ho oh, oh. get their bottom tower. Well, our Luna's pretty fucking dead. <laughs> She's just not a good pick against their carries. Unfortunately. The other fella's bottom tower's gone for good. I was gonna be like, who's the noob who placed this word? And then I looked and it was me. Well. Well, 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 well,
I recommend not going to the dark areas of the map, ever. Yeah, I was walking back, um, you know. Walk faster. You're getting bought, or bought tower there, you know. Teleport. The other fellas aiming to wreck your bottom tower. They do order. Yes. Look this guy running constantly in this whole thing. It's really cool. Oh, Wonder Lord's bottom now. Just Underlord things. On this quicker. See? Oh Everybody my god, did. another DD! Not Should get hurricane pick. Your mid tower needs a little. I don't help. think that's gonna help me. No, it's you, that's because he leaps. Yeah, you, and then you four staff away. You use the uh, the active of it, push him away. Tower's done for. That's why I have four oh, staff. I'm supposed to be the back line. I've yeah, but you get it. jumped because they picked heroes to counter you. Well, imagine if you played carry. What if you played carry? It wouldn't make a difference. Wouldn't that be cool? We would have lost wouldn't sooner. It'd be cool if like you could like carry the game because we usually win when we carry the game, but you just never want to play carry. This carry is extremely spot. boring. They're meaning to smash that bottom tower of yours. That top tower of yours ain't doing so good. I want to worth that, but I know he's still hanging out there. When he's about to get hooked, I just feel it. It's fucking Underlord, man. Can someone make a mod to kiss Mort? I read that as Muerta at first and was very confused. Yeah, me too, that's why I read. Yeah. But like that too? Ah, oh, they're up here. Oh, yeah. Man, I sure do wish I was level 16. You, what? Almost feel bad for your top tower. And that their whole team didn't have BKBs. <laughs> that would be swell. Might want to check your bottom tower. Just let Bot go. Like, oh, yes. Your bottom tower ain't long for this world. Bottom towers in a tight spot. Six in a row. Is this what it looks like when all lanes lose? I don't know if ours lost. I think ours might have drawn, but those are illusions. That's more that Huskar is. We just don't have a good counter for him. You need a lot of. Is done for. I guess the Marta would be the best. No, actually, Marta sucks against him. You need a lot of physical damage. Oh, God. She's running on you. His, his rain. I don't like this. 
Since the Husker is gonna run in here and she's gonna die. She's getting super green. I love that it's so cute emote. It's so good. The squishing. The aggressive squishing. When there's nothing left. That's what I do with, with Charlie when I go to bed at night. I'm like, squish. Oh look, it's their whole team. Isn't that great? Got TD again! Are you fucking <laughs> kidding me?! <laughs> <laughs> He's hacking. Report him for scripting. Stop hacking. Again? Or he did. Yes. Again? I'm very tired. I'm not really paying attention. I think we stay on the base. We just high ground to film. Excuse me. If he gets like two stacks of burning spears on you, you just pass away. Their whole team counters you, except for Underlearn. Woohoo! <laughs> Did all no buyback Dota? Put my pledge words up, can you tell? <laughs> I don't even know what this guy's saying because I can't hear him over the music, but I'm following him. Why don't you carry? Trampy! <laughs> really wanted to play Dota. Does this feel better than the Shadows? I don't know. Ew, I feel good. <laughs> it's okay, when I respawn, I still have my egg. I'll never know. It's such an annoying Yeah, we just don't have a good counter. We're all magic damage except for getting oh, okay. to Luna. And you're very squishy. So much for just a little tower. setback. Your bottom tower ain't long for this world. That's all we could. Is this owning ultimate? Might want to check your bottom tower. Hmm, well, they ran the fuck away, so it worked. They didn't need to, but they did. TP. Where's his thing? His portal's like right here. Where the fuck is it? You got lemonade and your beard is real soft. Thank you, Risu, for that information. <laughs> I could get one of these Obesity. Depression. Depression. Severe depression. Oh my god. Severe, severe depression. This valley. Love it, you read the title and the first thing you see is me yawning. <laughs> I forgot what the title was. <laughs> I just see his teleport. You can see it on the map. 
I can, can do it, Ellie. Yes, this is a sleep stream. An occasional screaming. Is there a combination of like sleeping and screaming at the same time? Oh, sick. Get BKB. Ooh. Yeah, that's gonna help. Yeah. I don't. No, I can't afford that. I'm making this item. Oh yeah, Shadows of Yawnum. I didn't beat them yet. They're, they're agonizing. It's gonna be a bad time. Oh good. Oh man. Please die! Okay, he died. Mission accomplished. That honestly wasn't too bad. You missed it because you were napping. That's okay, you didn't miss much of anything. Just spending two minutes running back to the boss after dying repeatedly. I gotta look up some strats. That's the first one that's been the real big issue. It's rough. Luna, no. No, Luna, no. No, Luna, no. Oh my gosh, she's so bad. She's so bad. She's just standing there disarmed. The other she can't do it. Ma'am, you don't have your BKB active. It's just the time for the dieback. Well, shoot, your top rags is in serious trouble. I would buy back, but I didn't make it. Don't think I can do anything here. Your bottom rags didn't shook up. They sure are. Yeah, they sure are bad. Didn't make it. They just picked the new heroes that we don't have a counter for. Well, that Huskar is dead for 50 years. Get ready for bed. Really? There's no ward here? Hmm? Oh, yeah, of course they got a feeling things are gonna pick up real soon. Sitting up that cliff, and I can't get a word up there. I hear that. Alright. Yeah, they're up on the ledge. Get some vision up there, but I don't think that'll be possible. So she's got to bash her own PA. I 
must have a war record. I don't know where they would have it. Look at Earth Century Sword. Dota, this sucked. as much damage as our muerto despite being half asleep and a support um Jakiro was alright but he was Jakiro we got Tuscar you gotta get wet do you say oh I gotta pee okay Oh god. VTubers with big anime titties are gross. Imagine being a VTuber and having giant honkers and milkers. That's so disgusting and unholy. I would hate to see a bunch of hot photos of big anime titties. No VTubers better reply with their giant melons. I would hate it. Eyes emoji. You sent Edith's three mini, but you think she's on lunch break or something? Now? Oh, that sucks. What am I reading? Uh, on my For You page on Twitter, it suggested Code Miku, Miko, the v VTuber, and she's posting to try to to try to prompt people to send her big anime titty pictures or something. What? Did you say big an- so I just get, came back and I heard big anime yeah, titties? Yeah, I, I got a- I went on Twitter for a second and it recommended me Code Miko and she, she was posting oh, yeah, about yeah. VTubers with big anime titties, that's what I was reading. Yeah, Code Miko, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright, go next. Seriously? I'm literally like, my eyes are not open. 
Drink some coffee. It's 12.30! <laughs> it's fucking 12.30. Should have built a fucking silver edge. That's why. Oh yeah, have. I always forget about that for how Star, that's a good one. And, and freaking PA. I was like, oh, I'm gonna get counter the PA with a monkey king bar and have enough damage like some other stuff. Yeah, true. Forgot about that. That's one of those items that is like, fair a bit, not like, super good at anything. That. Here, I know you're so tired and you think Carrie's so boring. Just play Carrie. No, cool. I should play Invoker. Invoker. Oh, that's cute. Quas, quas, quas. What's like super sleepy? Like Techies? Is that a sleepy hero? Uh, no. no <laughs> that's Big Boomba in the night. <laughs> big Boomba in the night. Yeah, big Boomba Goomba. <laughs> I need like a zero decision making hero. Uh, silencer. Nice. Maybe, um. Yeah. Who's like. I'm just looking. Like, just brain off. I mean, you could do the same thing the, uh. I do like your last game and just fuck. Just Rat. push lanes. Tyler's kind of brain off hero, too. You just press R <laughs> walk away. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big brain off. You can play support quap, that's a thing. That sounds terrible. Oh, it's actually good. That sounds absolutely it's terrible. It's actually really, really that good. That sounds horrendous. I mean, you basically, if you act as a support and then you have all quap's like damage, you just, I vaguely you... have to PP. Too. You didn't PP? Oh, I didn't PP. Play Terrorblade, there you go, that's a slam jam. Okay, entertain my Twitch chat, I'll be too much. Okay. Fuck. Big Chungus. Big Chungus. Big Chungus. Big Chungus. Oh my god. Big Chungus. Among us. Us. Sus. It's me, Shrimpy Doodle. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna play Dota today. <laughs> oh boy, make sure to follow me on my Insta and TikTok. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> uh oh, Toodles can't mute me. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, Toodles can't mute me or time me out if I'm talking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's that's why I like play Counter-Strike. She probably can't. Oh, oh, sh Risu, shut up. Risu, no. <laughs> that's no Risu. No! <laughs> um, what else is happening? There's something. Something dumb happened today. Okay. Hello? Okay. Oh, 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 Toodles, are you napping? Enjoy your nap. Panic nap. I was going, I was going, uh, I was, I was, I was pretending I was you and I was like, follow me on Insta and TikTok. Then, uh, Toodle, I was like, haha, Toodles, you can't mute me. And then, she was like, yeah, she can. And just go out. Visage is an easy hero. Go to bed before you turn into diamond. a pumpkin. It's too Cut late. A single diamond. I'm beyond pumpkin. But I'm not doing another one after this. Oh no, we have to we have to win. No, so um, if we lose this I'll just scream into Charlie's belly to... instead. I like that. We raiding. <laughs> huh? No one? Uh oh. Is that the Weavers? The Weaver?
<sighs> you sure you want to play it alone? Yes. Okay. It prevents me from going to Wendy's. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you ate though, right? Yeah, I had like two eggs and a piece of old toast. But That's you weren't listening to when I said that. That's not a dinner. It's not a balanced dinner. I was joking. Be gun Magoo. Okay. That's the same one I was mousing over. Somebody. Mm. Wondering. Later. Contemplating. Five seconds. Cannot take a charge game after the house of I feel like somebody's gonna take troll. I can be sniper again, but this time. Oh, there we go. Banded out. Beautiful. Easy game. Easy game. Oh. Uh... This is gonna be another we have no initiator. Ten seconds to go. I should do Viper. Five seconds. Oh, we have no big initiator with a stun kick? You're up. Oh, there. That's a big initiator with a stun. It's just making sure someone picks someone to go in. Why are you here? Just to suffer. Or, uh, don't worry, I trust our questionably Russian PA to carry us. Oh, good, good. His name is Ghosts of Ukraine. That's, you know, that's gonna be a real uh, human being there. Oh. the Dota community? I don't think it's better for Pudge. <laughs> we party. Don't worry, it's the good old Pudge... Pudge, uh, TA lane. That wind corner is gonna get a fucking vessel. I'm just gonna try. Oh, I just wanted to be a squirrel. Punchies. Oh, why did I get the Dark Willow, man? Is there a burb? What the fuck is that? Why couldn't I get, like, the Undying? You know what's so fucked up on my it's screen? It's a bit of a game, if you ask me. Yeah. Something was going on with my capture card, because the screen was Places, flickering everyone. during Bloodborne, but now Just it's not. Follow my tail. I don't know what was up with that. <laughs> so I got a cheap capture card for my... To use my camera on the uh, Amazon, and that caused the ca capture card that, that the game is using to flicker instead of the new one. I don't understand. Did you see a punch move? I'm king. Heroes made of glass. When in the group. Heroes made of glass. Thirty seconds to go. Where's my meatball? Always oh. wanted to go this way. Oh. My tail's a sail. My meatball's sitting on back like a huge bitch. Got me scrog. God, there was a no lot worries. of talking there. <laughs> it was just like. Ugh. 
Nice, the Russian begins. I need to get started. What's over here? The Russian. What? This way. This way. That didn't secure my last hit. Are you kidding Necro me? Autumn? Is this Necro on dying lane? Is this like the anti axe lane? Yes, it is. This axe is gonna have a bad time with freaking Heartstopper and Decay. <laughs> I will do my best. trying to pull and not realizing that it blocked the game. the murder stack? Probably the right way. Ripper. is so passive. Nice. Like, he's playing so fucking passive. I don't know he's got, like, the I can't believe it. in time. Oh. He's got, like, opposite day with, like, the stones down here so I can just kind of run around them. <laughs> they can't do anything. Pause it, peddling. Like even if he tombs I can just scurry I think. Throw down your gold. Hey, 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 ow. Let's do this the Hold easy on. way. Leave it. Oh my God, how is 
at our last hit. The tower, the thing didn't even hit. It's all on the way. Yep. Wicked. Is that my old life? Can you I'll lead the way. way. Get it. Got any I'm always on the right trail. There's a tomb down. Oh. And I resue, thanks for mod and thanks for hanging out. Hope you sleep well. Dota at 1 a.m. I got tomorrow off for What's a oh, warning shit. shot? Somebody's on a roll. Ever get yeah. a DD? No. Why are you up at 1 a.m. playing Splatoon? Hey, you! Okay, yeah, no. Okay, yeah, no. Splatoon isn't nearly as masochistic. Have you read Saltoon lately? Hiding. I'm Kate. <laughs> You're hiding? Oh. Yeah, his tomb should be down. Necro too. Necro too. Yeah. I had him pinned to the tree. The moment has passed. Yes. Your mid tower's in a bit of a bind. Here's a happy fella. Nice. Hate to be your mid tower right about now. Your mid tower's done for. I'm always on the right 
You couldn't stop me. I've been so long. Are you gonna be a problem? You take this? Over there. Yep. That's four in a row. I'll do the right way. It's how I live. Your top talent. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. I don't know what I expected. <laughs> I don't know either, but it was funny. <laughs> Trend in time. Your top towers hurt. I kind of want to hold top, but they're Look, pushing bottom really hurt. That top tower of yours ain't doing so good. Okay. Dire structures looking fortified. Look at this clock. Leave it. Almost feel bad for your top tower. It's all on the way. There goes your top tower. Okay. We hit the tomb. We hit the tomb. Oh, we hit the It's not even my birthday. What do you reckon? I said it's not even my birthday. Guess I'm getting the fuck out. There's a pango down there. No worries. They're meaning to smash that bottom. Poopy gun the goo. Yeah. What's wrong with Poopy Gun Magoo? Dominated. Oh my god! <laughs> the four bounty Always a step ahead. Isn't someone farming jungle? Why are they bounty rooms? They're farming this. She's jungle. farming one camp over and over again, maybe? <laughs> I don't know, they're Russian, so it's hard to say. Your bottom tower ain't long in this world. An anchor, just Not with good. a dagon, just walking around. Yeah. Is that an illusion? Is it just an illusion? Oh my god, Pudge, I try to do everything to save him. Yay, is pretty far up there for no reason. Anyone know we'll dip this way? Your bottom tower ain't long for this world. No, mother. Oh my god, why was she so fucking far up? She died to a neutral loose, so like, score. It's like up there with the note. Like, look at all the vision in the jungle, and then Dumbass is like up in the enemy triangle. Time to dish it out. Wicked. Spruce the place up a bit. Yep. That's the real Necro. Are there fucking they some moon over there? Where's the moon stand? Up here. Ripper. Yeah, it's just oblivious or just doesn't fear, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> doesn't <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Not yet. Your top tower. Yep, he is trouble. terrible. She just has no awareness. I'm king. Just you. 
Kill the fuck out of this pig. Do not blink her. She's a fucking monkey king bird for 15 minutes in the game. Okay. Game is hurt. This way. Her PA. And me. No worries. Roach on it. In the I'll punch it around and run it. Hey, you wanna see something really cool? Sold by. Well, thank you. I don't have any mana, but I'm here. <laughs> One in the groove. Axel's blank, but I don't think he can. Oh, oh you yeah, you gotta get out of here. Oh. Oh. Got me well, thank you. Did you see the next Splatfest yet? Yeah, I think we're gonna do we're doing Nessie or Aliens or something. Like I don't think Toodles can play, so it's I'll whatever you guys want. I'm not gonna play it some, but I will play a little bit. Just follow my tail. I don't really care either between the two of them. Just no Bigfoot. What this way? I need a neutral item, but I'm like. Anyone know where we're going? Your mid tower needs a little help. Ripper Air behind us. How did he miss his fucking call that bad? Nice. Oh, stupid. The stupid what's her name? The Willow man. Uh -huh. Don bullshit. Can't catch. This, this is a need to be KB versus that team Always team. The other fellas aim to wreck your bottom tower. You can't do nothing about dire structures okay. right now. Oh, really I want to check your bottom tower. I'll lead the way. I was meant to have okay. mid tower ain't doing too well. Think the gods are gonna help? I'll be the right way. Time to kill something? <laughs> My tail's a sail. Gotta follow my meatball. Your mid tower's coming apart. <laughs> Not particularly attacked either. That means we'll probably have to go Nessie. If greedy is the only one who cares. Wicked. Oh, is it time for PA to die? Just trying to fight. Here's a heck of a 
keep at it. Not yet. I'm keen. Where's That's the one. Yes, I'm done. You want to come in with trees, Pangolier? You really want to try to come out here? Yeah, it feel really exposed. Give you the grove, though. Your top tower's hurting. Time to kill something? Yeah, I throw some shit. Too. That top tower of yours ain't doing so good. Go this way. Almost feel bad for your top tower. Always a step ahead. Too bad about your top tower. We have a look through one of these. That's the one. Is there only right clicker? Did you see a punch man? It's what I do. Punch man. Oh, tree. Have you seen someone bleed out in the mix? No. Let's get started. <laughs> yeah. What? Why am I scouting this? Like, Drunken time. Yeah, Your mid tower needs a little help. Here we go again. Oh. 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 What is the range of these zombies? Yeah, they just, they just don't stop. It's, stuff. <laughs> it's all gone. Yeah. His positioning is giving me a heart attack. Fuck. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what is Pango? What is that? Uh, he got the like croc. a croc of something? A croc of male. We should play carry. It would have made a difference with this game. We needed another carry. No, shrimp Do you understand what's happening? Oh, we need a specter. No, we don't. We, they would have rolled us. They have better early game, which is why they're rolling us. Because we have a PA, which can't be fluff all until 40 minutes of the game. I have two blue balls in my inventory. I'm going to make no one that just saying that. Okay. Oh, my ult's up. We'll see who's got to next time. 
Why is there fucking zombies? Why is there fucking zombies? Who we fighting? If we can stall this like 20 minutes, we'll fucking lose. The other fellas lost a mid tower. Because they don't have a carry. Just like that. Yep. <laughs> My tail's a Thanks, Obana. <laughs> Obana. I'm always on the right trail. I'm king. Hate to be your mid tower right about now. The other fellas top tower radiant pulls it down. Cool. 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 Not poopy guy Magoo. That's this a should make my life tail. easier. Uh -huh. Excuse me, the PA just keeps trying to fight now and she has zero items, so that's, that's the problem here. She doesn't even have BKB. She hits like a little dick. Yeah, but, like that's yeah, really yeah, not yeah, enough yeah, to yeah, fight. It's not like a vomiting noise. <laughs> like, what it is. It is. It's fun <laughs> people. It's gross. Oh, I want that. Oh yeah, where do you have that? Yeah. Oh, I'm crashing. I'm crashing. Oh, oh. Fuck. Pause. Pause. Leave oh wait, no, no, no. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just a prank. I'm not crashing. I'll lead the way. The PA Your keeps just getting caught out constantly. Who we fighting? Your mid tower's gone. Like, you see where I warded? I gave her vision. The Pudge is not getting Your any. <laughs> <in a bit laughs> of a it's okay, like... he smoked. Well, the PA's dead, and they're all up, and they have an Aegis. Let's do this. My God! <laughs> you smell something? And he just thanks, Obama. Oh, yeah. Nice, get up, get up. There's a two right here. Dude, I can't even orb the double stun. Oh well, I was trying to hit the tune because our ridiculous PA is uh, standing underneath it and dying. Your mid tower's coming apart. Yeah, well played on dying. He pressed the tomb button and things died. <laughs> Very good, very good. I skill. Your mid tower ain't doing too well. Your mid tower's gone. Damnation. Them buildings are tough. I like the snackers build as brown boots and eggs and a dig on one. Other fellas are after you. I cannot orb in time! What the fuck is this? I can't orb him. I get stuck. That was so funny. I don't have my stun yet. Warming. I'm king. Other fellas are after you, mid rag. Look! Yeah! You know what? 
have this knocked Where do you think you've gone? Stop. Okay, she oh, just yeah. exploded. Yeah, they have so much uh, mana. I'm here. It's more like a dark willow in her secret shell. This one. Buy something. I think she wore it here. Should go to Axe. No, no, it's the, the ant staff. thing. Yeah, what about it? You want it? I have it. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. 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 That's good. Axe. Yeah, that's actually for Axe. Any blood trails? He's got a broom handle. That's the one. Here's a happy little fella. I go for a bit of bricky. Probably the right way. Jill the Kansa Umirka Giroi. Sure. That actually oh, popped. It's just it's it. it popped my fucking numbers. Oh my god. What the? The <laughs> illusion. There's low. Oh, uh, that's annoying. So. Did I ever get a fucking break in this game? Really? Like really? Am I here and there, or neither here nor there? It's how I live. Your bottom tower ain't long for this world. I was looking to ping for unused BKB there, but uh, your unused 9 second BKB, but apparently you can't ping allies' items when they're dead because it's so. <laughs> well, you can say why the fuck? They made up to smash that bottom tower of yours. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> your bottom tower's in the tower. Maybe they spot. just called it. Give them the benefit of the doubt. Hope you were partial to your bottom tower. Ain't a good time for your bottom That's rack. why I don't like PA though. Like, you, you, you need to just... The only way she works is if her team's stomping. Your yeah, she has space to farm. Because she shape. cannot do anything. Until then. Mid -rack didn't make it. Even then, like, to counter her, there's like... Ain't a good time for your bottom rack. They your don't bottom really have, rack. like, I guess the Windrunner countered her with the MKB. But outside of that, it's like not much. Uh, I think it's got a pistol. Oh, oh he's, he doesn't get hit by that. No, he's like a man. <laughs> Like, if this PA had any game sense, we could come back from this. She just needs to finish an item. <laughs> she can't. Got any scrog? And also remember to use a BKB. What the fuck is a BKB? Not yet. Not a 
This is why you Up should carry floor. shrimpy doodle. No, we would have lost earlier. You should carry. We have a VCPA. <laughs> no, I think you should carry. Yeah. Yeah. We would have Everyone's asking lost already. You smell something? Oh, 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 Someday he'll land a hook. <laughs> wasn't he was just undying yeah it was just <laughs> like, undying yeah like, it's like rank what's your rank 
like, bro, you got countered. I did almost three times as much damage as the PA. <laughs> With no items. <laughs> oh, she got shit on. Oh my god. <laughs> I should get the support KDA going there. <laughs> The problem is, like, too, if the Pudge had picked a normal support, she would have been able to farm in lane, but he picked fucking Pudge. <laughs> yeah, so the Pango and uh, Willow just clicked her out of lane, probably, and mm -hmm. Pudge couldn't do anything about it. He needed to pick, like, a hero that could actually do something there. Like a Lich or something. Something that does damage. Okay. I've lost 26 games in a row, Shrimpy. No, you haven't. I don't know how much more I can take. We literally won a game like last night. I picked PL. Yeah, and then you picked Razor and you picked Mars. You, no. you lost, you lost yeah. three games. <laughs> oh. What are you telling me how I feel? <laughs> Has my VTuber avatar been there the whole time and I just didn't see it? Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Wait, does it talk when I talk too or not? <laughs> I didn't even know it was there. That's does, great. Does it talk when I talk? <laughs> Hi! It's me, Swimby Chan. <laughs> Big Chungus. Big Chungus. No, it's just me. <laughs> oh, okay. I, did, I totally didn't even know that was there because I had something over that window. <laughs> That's funny. It was it there? Was it there? I think it was, right? Why wouldn't it be? Put it under it. Just uh, restart Dota and we'll just play one more. And no. Then... Maybe the yeah, Dota was on top of it. Yeah. Also, okay. my game is shuttered. Hard. I don't know what the hell. Yeah, you crashed the past couple times. It, it almost crashed and weird. it like was like glunk. That's weird. It's cursed. Yeah. I gotta go the fuck to sleep and get the, my all eyeball right, yeah. poked tomorrow. Yep. I gotta poke yeah, my eyeball. All right. No, they're not gonna poke it. GG. Good night. GG. How could you call that GG? That's so awful. I had fun that so last game. That was terrible. That I was agonizing. Fun. It was like someone shitting down your face for hours. That's what it felt like. I had fun. I picked a hero I like oh, playing. How, how do you have fun? Like, what are you, are bottom? Like, what, what, what is this? I pick heroes I like playing. That's why I don't play carry. I pick something I would like. Whether we're winning or losing, yeah, I like and have OD. fun. Me Either too, way. but I like I don't like take you take my hero and slam it into ground like like flaccid penis, like being kicked, like with with the hedge clippers. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for watching, guys. I think he called me, but I'm confused. What's happening? Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm going to fuck sleep. You guys should sleep too, unless it's daytime, and then don't- Oh yeah, we, we always have fun with Dota. We have so much fun. Um, I think I'm streaming Sunday, guys. I think we're gonna do some more Bloodborne. I don't know if it's gonna be BL4 or Son of a Bitch. <laughs> Son of a Bitch! Um, I don't know if it's gonna be BL4 or if we're gonna level up, because Shadows of Yarnum are terrible. But Thank you all so much for watching tonight. Thank you everyone for lurking and for chatting and for all the uh the raids from we had raids from Scarlet Letter from Tabby from Nines from Winsome. Thank you guys for the raids, for the follows. Everyone's asleep. I'm not gonna raid anyone because I'm going right to bed. 